Hello, Matt. Kill tank destroyers. Okay. Cause I hated spittle designated driver yuck going to a bar yuck <laughs> crew position ready up driver ready gunner ready loader ready
Of fucking course. Oh, my elevation drive is trying. Just camping in your own spawn. He's actually just camping, man. That P8 fly over the AO drop nothing, get no kills, and it's just leaving now? What?
I just like <sighs> what compels someone to just sit in their spawn? He doesn't even have that much time. What has compelled this guy to feel that doing that is the most effective way to play the game? Also, this dude is a fucking 4 to 1 in arcade in the Panzer 3. That's incredible. And, and the Panzer 4C. That's, that's, that's pretty good. But in RV, he's just terrible. Into your vehicle. Button up. Driver ready. Scanner ready. Motor ready. I don't know why I thought that would have higher velocity.
wonder if they fixed the Sav's instant reload thing. The Sav is absolutely still bugged. You, it has unlimited ammo in this ready rack. Wow. I'm glad this hasn't been fixed. So where's like the Swedish Chaffee? I'm sure they used one. Uh, they can get the Norwegian ones. Okay, good. There's a Norwe the Norwegian normal one, and the Fox, Fox standard one, and then there's the NM116, which has a laser range fighter and then low, uh, low pressure 90mm. That's terrible now. Is it the Cockroll 90 or is it the... I'm actually French not one. sure. I think it's the French one, but I'm not okay. Because if it's the French one, that's acceptable. If it's the Cockerel 90, <laughs> absolutely <laughs> not. I'd rather have the 75. Yeah, but then, like, they have two different versions. Like, the baseline, yeah. and then that was the upgraded light. Okay, we need something for uh, recon units. I just realized I just blinded the shit out of myself. I, it's okay, dude. Should I let him cap the zone or just kill him?
got the bomb glitch, which pissed me off immensely. And then the like play no ground was annoying me. But then that match ended with me having uh, six and a half thousand score, and we lost because you know low tier teams are never bad. Yeah. I think even the Soviets got like a few from Lendley's, or at least they bought or got some for evaluation from somewhere, probably. Because like Vietnam, ha I'm sure they had them because the Vietnamese definitely got some from the funnies. Uh, free seven, okay. On is, which is the French new AA, which is pro I think the last tank in the game. I don't know the 120s. I haven't finished that yet, so I won't lie. Let me. There we go. Uh, Soviets received two Chaffees through Lendleys. Haha, <laughs> my memory never fails. <laughs> <laughs> also, Madagascar. <laughs> 380 M24s. Turrets of retired M24s were fixed into PT-76 chassis. Oh, you know, there we go. Instant Russian premium. What am I even technically doing? The T72. All right, good, fantastic. AMX M16. Let's so I'll just bring more ammo. It doesn't fucking matter. It's the sav. Like I'll just bring full ammo. It doesn't matter. This thing has an unlimited ready rack. Time to ruin my mid range or KD for this thing. I think my highest kill games. I no Calliope is still the highest. The, I will never beat 31 in Calliope. Yeah, yeah the, the car the things back when it was yeah. new. Yeah, it did things. Oh, the rocket landed near you. Goodbye. Oh, it's also tied to the gun, so you can aim it over stuff? Wow. Oh, and someone shoots you in the rockets, it's black and still fires and doesn't detonate. Mm -hmm. I got, I think, 
27 with this. I never actually get to get those, like, excessively high kill games, because the enemy team just quits. Yeah, that, like, I, those games just don't happen anymore. And that was back when everything cost a billion points to spawn in, and you would still have yeah. people spawning in, like, ten times. Because they had an incentive to. <laughs> like, yeah. you, gained, you gained RP from it, and the game didn't... The game had its bullshits, but it was consistent bullshit. Well, and you, like, there was nothing in the game that you could spawn in and fight at your PR that you couldn't kill. You could kill yeah. everything you saw. Thanks to pixel weak spots. There's a fuck ton of them over the hills looking towards There's us. There's a bunch in front of us. Yeah. They're all playing so passive. And I didn't get any hits with artillery, even though I put it directly on top of these guys, which is, you know, not, not cool. Competing for kills with a US-75 when there's a fucking sap next to you. <laughs> it was Jover. Dude, just outshoot me. Oh yeah, true. I'll Don't tell my ear. Don't forget about your fucked up, like, optics. We're good. I'm a professional shitty sap user. Say that and miss my next shot. That's set as you up there. So be slightly aware. Someone shot at you, that's rude. No, I shot the ground to reload it. Oh, I know I didn't get shot at. I don't know, up here somewhere? Somewhere over there. Oh, that's a fucking tree. I'm gonna die. Ooh. Yep. Okay. Dude. Oh, uh, why the hell, man? I hate this oh. map. Oh, yeah. Like, ever since they added in that second spawn, this map is just terrible. How does that guy see me? Like, what the fuck? The same guy. Somehow he saw me, despite the fact that I'm below the hill. And he angled it perfectly so that it hit the ground in front of me, ricocheted into the turret roof, and killed half my crew. And that guy is not good enough to do that on purpose. Hmm. Uh, there's an IL-2 up. There's two. Uh, Mr. Stogman is there. Yeah, I'll get him a second. I'm not even yeah, 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 I'm just, just letting you know. See, this guy's turning. <laughs> uh, that's a KV. Pro tip, shooting under the KV-1 does not kill it. There's at least two AA in the new spawn. Yeah, they're both BTRs. Oh, 
I'm visible from out here already. That's good. Any more days till it comes out? We've been waiting on it for years. Yeah, it's good. good. Hopefully, it's good. And you decide to retire from security. Yeah, security is one of those jobs where it's incredibly easy 99.9% .9 of the time, but then a 0.01% it sucks. It's also boring as hell. Yeah, I'm leaving those guys. They can keep that cap, or the cap to this point. <laughs> Managed to See. not kill his gunner. He's down to two. Oh, wow. There's uh, three BTRs. That's crazy. There's a KV1 driving towards A. Backup BTR. Wow. Could have guessed. <laughs> yeah, I'm finishing spading the greatest attacker plane ever devised by the US. I see. But I came to the conclusion. Oh, yeah, I also have the SP2C, but I'm There's three. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. One on my mark, one over here, and the one shooting red tracers. Oh yeah, this oh, I got tapped by a BTR. Oh, the fucking fire went out. Okay. Well, I'm dead. The first shot that they fired took out my engine, my control surfaces, and my elevators. So, you know. Definitely was able to keep the line I was going for. I say, uh, AI generated stuff. The word cows comes up, spelled C A W S. Hmm. Yo, old cow. There's air, I'm dead. There was four anti-airs that I had to fight. Yeah. Oh, I 
hit slightly to the left, that's why the guy didn't die. It's fine. There should only be one AA left in the seaside spawn, it's a uh, Contrero with two crew down. And then there was something in the air, I don't know what it was. Oh, I'm getting shot at by a uh, PTR, wow. Oh, so they did spawn a backup PTR. Teachers yeah. only shooting at me. Uh, oh yeah, they, they were only shooting at me until teammates who then would have had three passes decided to do head-on dives at them. Like from the direction I was flying. So they just slightly adjusted, shot the guy and then kept shooting at me. I'm not saying I was flying smart at all, but... There's two Contreras. Yeah. Oh, sorry, it's a BTR and a Contrero. Oh, there's a plane over me! Fuck! Oh, it's dead. Never mind. There's one on the other spawn as well. Ow. Oh, that was an AA that was, that was shooting. Yeah, yeah so that's why I marked it. Yeah, I know I shot an H bar directly into it and it just gave me a hit, so I thought it. Was that him? And he, yeah. That's not where the tracers were. There has been an insane amount of AA in this game. anti-airs at least. That's uh, that is incredible.
Uh, I'll let you know once I find my Giva Cares. <laughs> because <laughs> they were not here for that match. Hmm. Let's see. AA gun one. I probably counted some of the backups twice. Two. But... Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, thirteen AAs. So I did count something twice. Whatever. Thirteen. Oh, I might have missed one too. I, I was not really like my eyes are kind of fucking up right now. It's pretty bad. They all were spawning back up, so probably just counted one of them twice. I don't know. Like the vigilante, working security. I mean, being responsible for money and like other stuff usually doesn't even. I mean, I guess you have to pay more attention, but generally it's still pretty calm. Like your funny haha -ha robberies and shit just don't happen anymore. Time for Operation Hill in my Sherman without a Brew 50. Because the French are morons. Crew position. I mean, that's why I still make fun of the European nations. It's like, all the time, they don't put 50s on their tanks. Like, I understand the purpose of not having one, but still. M2, the best gun ever developed. There is a reason that we have a very specific plan. I like that. I like that the Play-Doh ground is already happening, and I'm not even in the air yet. <laughs> uh, but yeah, the, there is a reason why our roof-mounted FN will mysteriously become a, of Russian origin if we actually have to go do stuff. Oh man, we found all these dishkas in a box. <laughs> oh, our. <laughs> Our recon units don't can't find their air defense weapons. Don't know what happened to them. This this guy we found it on the ground. Yeah, there's a guy up here. I think it's a Tetrarch or Daimler. Yeah. It definitely was. It's just such a weird doctrine to not. Like, it can't be a cost issue, right? Like it's just a doctrine issue. It's a little bit of both. I see! Oh, I overangled. Hello, Chad. That's That was completely my fault. Dude, are you kidding? Is this tank is day 13 cover? They also, like, even further ruined this map. They added a bunch of trees everywhere. Yep. So your visibility is like fucked. It was to help try and curb the cross map shooting, but it didn't yeah, really fix how about it. It just fucking fix the map. <laughs> no. No, you're dumb. Like that. Like that's what I was saying about. I hate the guided solution to balancing is just visual obstructions. the fuck? That's not good. 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 Oh yeah, I can scout in this thing. I keep forgetting. Yeah, we've got enough scout assist for that. 
nice archer. There's a fucking martyr sitting there, man. Give me a second, there's the plane diving in. I can't see him because of these trees. Hello, oh, Don. I was overshot by a mile, so those can kill me. I was about to say that if those kill me, I'm quitting. Oh yeah, I also need to remember that this thing has 50s as well. Yeah, you're a variable velocity gun. Oh yeah. I got four hits into that. <laughs> Did I hate the bunkers? Side spawn. Oh, I couldn't see him through the tree. Yeah, that. Why balance the game when you can just make stuff RNG and RNG and obstruct visually cluttered. He couldn't see me either, I don't think. He just blind fired through the tree. Uh, Do I go on runs occasionally while they're physically running? I mean, every day I take the doggo out. Diving in, and my teammate is shooting him from a mile away. Okay. Yeah. Fucking disintegrated. Yep. Still love all the people. It's like, oh, you have a husky. You're not. Warm climate, you're evil. Yes, it's almost like insulating fur works both ways. You're wrong. Oh yeah, true. You're just boiling your dog alive. Yeah. Like your labs and stuff that have just as much fur, those are fine because they're you know different. They're so they're family dogs. Hello, Cloud. I snuck. So it in this one. Yeah. How to actually fuck up your husky? Yeah. One -on -one. Uh, the fire crest is back. It's diving from high again. Okay, so yeah, he had a bad time previously. Rearm. He's having a bad time again. VTT DCA. Okay. So M16, but on a tractor. Oh. You all roll over and get that guy if you don't. 
I don't know what it is. Oh, it's a T28. Uh oh. He killed my gunner. That's not allowed. Thank you. Do not have parts. Okay. It's a Valentine, that part. <laughs> I will reiterate. I do not have parts. I am a stationary pillbox with Pierre. People bathe their husky's ice cubes in cold water to not lose their hair. I mean, I maybe, but that would be dumb as hell. Like they have a summer coat and a winter coat. They don't really change how they look. It's, but people give them ice and stuff to lay in. But like, most huskies don't want to get wet naturally because wet equals bad. Yeah, that's like really bad. Like they can get wet, but they don't want to get soaked. They can actually start like growing mold and stuff on their undercoat. It's really bad. You have to make sure you dry them a lot. I mean, I could get it to make noise, but it's generally very quiet. Oh, and yeah, sorry, morning, uh, Jan. My brain is in, like, the not functioning stage of aneurysms. I have a plastic horsey I got from a kinder egg, and it is the epitome of entertainment at the moment. Because it has the same IQ as I do at the moment. Underclouds. Yeah. But yeah, the VTTTTDZA. Surprisingly, an armored platform with the M16 or M45 mount. Wow, it's effective. <laughs> I am shocked to my core. <laughs> I want the one that they built the one off with the Into quad miniguns on it. No. The, <laughs> how much ammo do you want to waste? Yes. Yeah. You know, like, that would actually so be a cool event vehicle for them to add, even though it would be kind of just a meme. Yeah. be a meme pseudo-effective AA platform. Oh, it would absolutely slap his AA. Yeah, well, that's what I... Pseudo-effective, as in, it would be effective as an AA platform, but it would do nothing on the ground. Unless oh, yeah. they gave it fucking slap. <laughs> 7 mm 7.62 slap. Hell yeah. Hello, man. I mean, it was a thing. They tried to develop it. Okay, so I'm about to have a momentum. Never mind, he's bad. And I am shooting this milk truck in the face with the 50 cal. But I'm being surrounded, which is not great. I think that's an SMK. And I ricochet, I am dead. Yep. Sorry, there's a Sherman who's like Omega slow peaking here. Yeah, it's not your fault. I thought we had teammates. And someone dropped artillery here, so I like literally can't push, I'll die.
I wish artillery was just gone from the game. Yeah, so when that guy spawns a backup of his SMK, it's eating all of them bombs from this piece of shit. That's coming from yep. I love my inside clouds. Oh what? Yeah, I'm dead. Why is he looking at me? Okay. Oh yeah, and this has the fucking drop arm as well. I don't know why I put that thing in. Yeah, that's why I love client side clouds. That guy was able to see me that whole time. Hmm. But I never once saw him before he was already on me. Oblivious, but he's there. And uh, yeah, hello, nine. You, you got to see a oh, deer. Oh, I ran out of ammo. Back. That's not good. <laughs> okay. Oh, that's unfortunate. There's the truck. Okay, I know you can like seriously fuck a truck up by hitting a deer with it. I'm also really glad that that dude is in a Spitfire and just playing like an absolute bot because he's expecting to win because he's in a Spitfire. Yep. And that he's sitting inside of a cloud and knows that he can't be seen. But... Well, actually, he probably didn't know that he can't be seen. He's just that shit that he was still just coming straight at. And I That would, no, don't you, no, no. The players in this game are passive enough as it is. We don't need that garbage. Honestly, artillery should just be removed from the game entirely. Yeah, no, but that's still too, too many. Like, it, it's just a fundamentally flawed idea. You would just be sitting AFK doing nothing for an extended period of time. It, it brings nothing nothing to the game at the expense of costing you four players at a time.
And you would have to be so far away. Like, it would take seconds for your shells to arrive. They would have to... They would have to completely rework HE. They would have to rework the entire, like, long-distance firing system to ensure that the shells are rendered in properly. They would have to give them a separate spawn, which is further away from the map than everything else. Like, kilometers away to, to get yeah. an accurate hit. Like, to get a top-down hit from that, for the howitzer, you'd have to be so far away. It, like, nothing about it. And that would all be to facilitate a mechanic that is built around essentially not playing the game. The game already extensively suffers from issues related to players not understanding the game at its core, not having the equipment for the tier, only having one spawn, yada yada yada, whatever. That would just mechanically make that situation worse. Yes. So that thing you just said right there is why I hate YouTube videos. That is a couple kills he got where he fired like 15 to 20 shots, got the kill. Out of how many, match. how many games did it take him to do that? You can, and for the argument, like you can make it pseudo consistent against AAs. But that's still taking yourself out of the battle to try to meme AAs of the enemy team. And relying on the map being a very specific map. Like, you are not being effective when you do that. You are that's being a waste of a team slot. Also an incredibly low velocity gun. The yeah. actual, like, real SPG, like 155s, <laughs> are not low velocity. Hello, small. Like, it just as in a gameplay mechanic, it would be bad. There's a reason why artillery is one of the most hated gameplay mechanics in World of Tanks. That's why I quit playing that game. Crew position. Up. Ready. Ready. Like, if they have to have artillery pieces, like self propelled how it's just in the game, which I don't agree with. The way they have them currently is the only way they can go about it without the game becoming inherently flawed even further than it is. Don, yeah, do, you, but, do you know that real world artillery, like unless you're using American stuff, you're firing like thousands of rounds to saturate a single grid square and you're not going to hit what you want to. You're just, I'm team killing this guy. Like, you're just firing hundreds and thousands of rounds to try and hit something. Like... Like, excluding guided shells like the Excalibur, Artillery is not effective at point shooting. Effect. Ar artillery is an area saturation weapon, which causes immense amounts of casualties because it <laughs> that means that there is shrapnel within a grid square on the map. Yeah, and it's also like a battery of howitzers doing it, or a battery of like towed guns. It's not and one dude. <laughs> And those guns are 7 to 40 kilometers away. Okay, I hit the side of a T-50 and ricocheted, so now he's out on the side. I'm about to just J out. Yes, 
since modern world drone operators in com are essentially just artillery spotters, which used to be guys with binoculars in forward deployment. This is Done with this BR. I yeah, shot right. the side of a T50 and a Puma and ricocheted both of them. I don't care, just pick something. Uh... Also, artillery is always pre sighted to shoot in a very specific spot, and all of the artillery pieces are all sighted in for a very specific range. So, having hey. to adjust your range or your like horizontal positioning is uh can be quite the chore and they alternate the amount of charges they put per round based on how far they want the round to go and it's like okay we put the absolute minimum amount of powder into this thing which increases the chance of it misfiring to decrease the range to 10 kilometers instead of 15. US 487 German German Berber 477 okay uh, you feeling like mid high or top t or top ish tier I don't care uh, let's do some alpha jet things then realize how horrid these teams are and then go to something else. Did I never get the Alpha Gen? No, I never did. Whoops. Whatever. Yeah, the G91. I think it's just G91. It's on the 80k. I'm in a drone operator will never actually replace true reconnaissance because a drone is uh, very susceptible to a lot of things. It's an amazing tool, but it will never become the only thing on the battlefield for reconnaissance purposes. I mean, there's already stuff that you can make at home with shit you can buy at a normal store that completely shuts down drones. You just point it at it and it basically intercepts all signals and just crashes it. Essentially, if you think about something that you see quote unquote in real life that you think would be cool in game, most likely there are 17 different factors related to it that you're not thinking of or seeing in that piece of media that make it essentially useless or pointless in the game. And if this game was realistic, it would be unplayable. Well, I mean, this this shit wouldn't even be usable. The engine would explode. You would get, like, shot one time and your crew would bail. It wouldn't even necessarily have to be a penetrating hit. If you get hit, don't know where it came from. Leave the vehicle rather than get shot. Got a shot by a fucking mile. Because I am bad at the game. Also, you'd be able to, like, America would just be straight up the most overpowered nation in the game. Like, if America. This isn't even like a lol America thing. Like if America actually got access to all of their weapon systems, the game would be unplayable. The amount of money the US like 
MIC has in comparison to the rest of the world is fucking obnoxious. And it shows. The uh, smart cluster bomb thing. Yeah, you dropped it. It uh, wiped out 20 people simultaneously. Okay. Gameplay. <laughs> oh, you don't even have to mark them. It just does it automatically. Cool. Oh, and you can carry like 10 of them. Cool. <laughs> oh, you punched in GPS coordinates for where it needs to find people from. Oh, it did it. Okay, cool. Like, American Ordnance in this game is super ultra gimped to make it, like, playable against. And it's... It's not even special operations, if, like, if it's talking about Ukraine specifically, like, drones are just a common tool for all units now, because it's an easy, cheap way of getting forward requirement. Recon in a sense, whatever, recon in a very static environment. So instead of risking guys going out to forward observation posts, you just send out a cheap drone that you can buy from the shelves, and then it gets broken down, but you get some information based on it. And then you are able to get, do stuff that is, uh, create operations based around it for what is needed and what your resources are. I hate this fucking weather. I can't see anything. Dude, you don't like weird void fog? Are you dumb? Yeah, true. My bad. Should have just side climbed. Where's your VT-1-2 at? I'm busy scouting for the BT-1-2. And my BT-1-2 is in the lineup, I just didn't spawn it. Oh, it's so great on this version of the map, because you can just teleport yeah. over here and shoot everyone on the side. Dude, I beat a rad wagon, or no, I beat, I don't know, some real shit over you, here. You beat everything. Like, the power and weight on, well, weight on that thing is obnoxious. There's a prop. Yeah, he bad. I think someone's trying to come over to you, but I can't see in the void fog. Like lower. Close. Okay, I've been hit. I like how there's an alouette or scout directly above us on the map. He's just there freely when we have a Geppard. Oh, the Geppard figured out that he can shoot up. So I, how I have my control set up right now, I go from primary to auxiliary instead of firing the auxiliary. So it just changes my points of aim and I can just click. So I can just... <laughs> oh shit. I use the secondary side as well. Yeah, but in-game, the attack drones that are in the game are a absolute and utter waste of spawn points. Maybe if we got the Reaper. But that would be cancer, so let's not. Like we... <laughs> That's also not the Reaper. That is the MQ-1 Predator. I see. <laughs> I, 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 
shouted him, then I saw his, him turn his turret 90 degrees to the guy spraying machine guns at him. I peeked out. His turret, <laughs> a shell comes out of the side of his turret. I die. Like, the only reason we have those drones in game is because Gaijin was trying to figure out people who bought top tier premiums were bitching that they could never get to kill anything in the air. So they gave them a tool that can be utilized for it. Which is an absolute waste of points and a absolute nuisance that should have never been added, but it's Gaijin. So. Hello, runner. Good dog, Springer. Oppa salla erberia. Oh yeah, I need to spawn that term so I can do the Zestera effectively. The destroyer 45. I need to do term. Oh, cool storm! Yay! Oh, shit. Ready up! the TAM2 IP was the same VR as this, and it uh, didn't weigh anymore, <laughs> and it just had DM23 and was like invincible, it, it was or DM33 okay. and just like invincible. Oh my god, well, I'm late because these DFs decided to cut, cut each other off and in front of me so I couldn't go past them. Yeah, that sounds good. Thank you, you can change your display name on YouTube as well. There's a car, uh, object 120. Uh, going left. I'm going to kill this guy. Uh, second guy behind him. Uh, not a pen. We love no Hi, non appende SU 100P. With this, I don't know what I shot. I just saw him. Did I, did I tell you about the argument I had about tanks being able to drive through trees? So, <laughs> I think you mentioned something in that vein. Me no hitting that tree well. in the TAM just made me rethink about it. It's like, tanks going full speed should not be stopped by these trees. Main danger in those in that is that tree getting caught if the tree is too hot, tall, the top half getting caught and slamming through the hatch to kill the crew if it's open. Like that's the reason there are cautions regarding. Oh, what the fuck? It's a BMP-1 that's 105 resistant. Is he still there? Man? It's there, yeah. He's in the smokes. I'm getting shot from spawn too. It's a WZ. Oh, he did. Oh. 
It's the T-H-E, man. That was his backup WZ, right? I think so. Yeah, I'm just spraying my 30 mils to get the new belt in. Yeah. Oh, and then there's also RO6 man. That was, that was pretty cool. Oh yeah, that, that one was... Dude, RO6 is a good squadron, okay. <laughs> oh yeah, uh, the gamers. And they play squibs, so they know everything. They're absolutely not the shitters. We absolutely dumpster 24-7 for free points. But they're definitely not in the category where 7 out of 8 of our players were blackout drunk and we still beat the shit out of them. The- oh, let's- aww. Oh. Scamping. Um, the- well, whatever. You can spawn whatever you want because it doesn't matter. <laughs> I think one of our air players still has their eyes open. <laughs> Am I going to die? No, okay, you can dive out of the cloud. If you dive straight down, you dive before you hit yeah. the mountain. Ow. Hey, I guess I'm just coaxial 30 ain't that. M60 since his crew would not die from 105. <laughs> but it's okay, he shot me with his 105 and we're fine. There's also air next to me that's very mad, or above me rather. Okay, yeah, this is the Russian guy I was hearing. Yeah. How'd that happen? One on L28. Oh no. That is a T10. Oh no. Wait, that's a T10 with no eyes. That's good. We like that. I was oh, almost RT1. scared. RTB, because he shot off one of my elevators, so I have no authority at all anymore. Okay, so that's an indestruct. Oh, it's an AMD. Well, that kind of not good. No, Sweden does not use an Abrams. What? They use leopards. Oh, I need to reload this piece of shit. I am now full Wing. Like, I definitely should have died already, because... But that T-10 was blind, so I'm alive. Like, there is no reason for me to be alive currently. But hey, with all the bullshit that's happened today and yesterday, I'll take it! I see. If I'm going under 600, I actually can pull a little bit. <laughs> Without snapping. No, like, it, it, I can just pull it all. Oh. Oh, you're broken. Yeah, okay, okay. Uh, that makes more sense. Okay, so our whole team has left, and the enemy just doesn't want to go for the objectives. Which, you know... And a millisecond before I capped, a guy in front of our teammate, with his ass towards the teammate, shoots me. Good. Ooh. Well, I mean, whatever. I got the alpha jet. Oh, I almost had the nuke. And uh, now I need to be sad now, right? Oh, yeah. I said that the enemy just doesn't want to go for the objectives, so like two seconds later they're capping both objectives and killed me off the cap. Whoops.
Nordics are already confirmed to be a part of the Swedish sector. There's a MiG-15 fish. There was a MiG-15 bis. Okay. He had a uh, Alpha Jet ex experience. Our team's gone. Yeah. Sick. They're probably just spawned like a Gebbard and finished off the nuke. There's a heli somewhere below me. Oh, that's a Shilika. <clears throat> and that's my one sh I hate... Tracers nowhere near me and then my control surfaces just disappear. Yeah. Absolute and complete dog shit. Yeah, I was barely adjusting and he was just missing. Yep. Toad. That's a BMP2 on C, watch out. Yeah, I did. It's because it, a fragment hit your hand. It hit one, well not your ammo, it hit one of your hydras and it killed you. Like, I know exactly what happened, that's a pretty common thing with the LAVAD and HE. I'm assuming it didn't show you a kill cam either. Guy. Oh, sitting in the corner there. That's cool. Yeah, I mean, there's not really much point in even trying anymore. No, they're manually controlled. Jeff, all night. Could you imagine? <laughs> I am not spawning anymore. They're just sitting in every red spot possible in that city. Point in trying. Disabling ground camouflage from the Gipper. Hello, Wolf. Yeah, but uh, that actually, like, that, that is really common with stuff with exposed rockets and missiles. To die to random, super far away explosives. It always, it depends on the patch's fragmentation damage, which I guess this patch fragmentation damage is super high on the Nords. Compensate for it, they broke all HE effects and made the smoke trail on the Nords excessive. Yeah. So it, it all balances out, it's fine. Oh, yeah, I, I put a Talisman on both of the Alpha Jets just because I realized that I'd rather 
get them done faster without having to spend GE on the modules. So, not that I have anything I need to grind in either air trade, but <laughs> I always like having talismans more than I do buying the modules in anything where the, some of the modules aren't like absolutely necessary from the get-go for it to not be cock and ball torture. And if the desync wasn't as bad as it is currently, uh, and we didn't get shit weather constantly, we could show some uh, funny stuff with the Nords. Yeah. Later, so. Hazy. That's not the worst. Oh yeah, I still need to play this term. Oh yeah, the term has a laser range finder, doesn't it? It should. Yeah. Just never. Like, I, I know I should be using it in a lot of vehicles. But I just refuse to get accustomed to it because I'd rather keep the touch of like eyeballing it. Oh, it's way faster to just shoot. Yeah. But there are specific situations where it's just so much. Oh, if there's just like a but, pixel, yeah. then I'll laser range find it because you know it just gives yeah. you hacks. But. I got the worst spawn imaginable. I'm already here. <laughs> yeah. I got I got a mediocre spawn. Not there yet. Uh, Hell yeah. There you go. What? He could see me? Better. What? He could shoot. <laughs> oh my fucking god, man! Get out of here with that. Oh, I see. They've gone back to the thing where you can't, uh, you don't get maximum amount of score for caps if there's another guy there. Yep. I see. I YOLO pushed that guy because I turned his breach dark red. But Oh that yeah. doesn't matter. They will fire like you can always fire your gun if it's broken. And it will always fire. It'll break it, but it will always fire. Sure is a great mechanic. Sure do love all these. It's literally a game. mechanic, so shitters don't get punished for playing badly. Yeah, because we don't have enough of those mechanics in the game yet. Oh. Let's make everything inconsistent and RNG. Hell yeah! need everything to have visible HP and all guns to have a specific damage modifier. Uh, there's a heli next to the oil rig. Oh, I see you're already trying to do a funny thing to him. Yes. Oh, you had the AA once. Okay. Yeah, and I can't. I didn't have enough for AS. Yeah. Wow, how'd uh, you do that? I, I don't know. It marked one eyeballs. Trust.
I mean, honestly, currently with how consistent the HE damage from bombs is, that was half an achievement. <laughs> like, RNG in video games is awful. Like, on Tarkov, they actually got rid of fragmentation. There's no more fragmentation in the game. Which is oh, funny, because... I'm gonna cause... die! I'm gonna die! I'm gonna die! Never mind, I'm dead. Okay. I'm better than them. Um... Myth actually brought this up to me, which made made it really funny, because Tarkov's trying to be this, like, uber-realistic game, and then they put fragmentation in, which is literally critical hits. <laughs> uh, there's a 163 somewhere. Right. Yeah, I, I remember that time I uh, critically hit someone with a bullet. Because, you know, that's how it works. The 163 just died. Yeah. I showed the uh, Chinese player why this alpha jet is a lot better than the French one. <laughs> <laughs> I clicked the key and then I pressed the mouse and now he's dead. There's another Gepard, but I can't, uh, it's not rendering. So, it's in this spawn. Runner, oh, yeah. that, that would make sense in the aspect of like a grenade but in Tarkov you get fragmented like do you know how fragmentation used to work in Tarkov with guns because it was uh yeah oh I think that's a backup AA that's not good yeah that is definitely oh he's looking at me why I... yeah that, that's not good so, I am going back to the airfield, because I am missing a lot of pieces from one hit. Namely, my rudder and half my wing and both my flaps. Yeah, so fragmentation was on bullets, okay? All bullets, including armor-piercing bullets, and it would just give you an extra 40% or 50% damage, one of the two. So, your, uh... M61 armor piercing round going through someone's plate would just, you know, randomly, like, 10% of the time do 50% more damage. You know, because that armor piercing bullet is flangible and explodes 10% of the time. But only 10% of the time. It was just a stupid fucking mechanic. Instead of building, like, instead of putting that into the bullets damage, they made it random. Uh, watch for the shell gun. It is absolutely not realistic for armor piercing bullets to fragment like that. How do you run out of ammo in a T-72 when you only have 6 kills? <laughs> like, like, what? <laughs> it's okay, we made it back. I'm like, are you being fucking stupid? Like, you don't have to be in the army to know how firearms work. Like, armor-piercing ammo doesn't fragment. It's literally a solid core of usually tungsten. Or steel to penetrate. It doesn't break apart. Like that would defeat the whole purpose of the bullet. Like, like tungsten is hard and brittle as fuck, but it doesn't explode on impact. It breaks if it doesn't go through. And bullets don't really fragment either. Like most bullets, even hollow points, don't fragment, they expand. It's why oh, that I would say that server, <laughs> yeah. Like the Don't actual no frangible issues. shit, like rip with the stupid pedals, that stuff isn't even that effective. Like the amount of damage it does compared to a traditional hollow point round is like negligible.
Hello, Blue. Yes, hello, Blue. I believe M855A1 and M995 have two-piece ammunition that actually split and cause a, uh, I guess, air quotes. You want to do something very stupid? Go to the right in the VT. Oh, yeah. We can't do that, by the way. On this version, we might. I don't I've seen think two so. different versions at these tiers where it's been open on the other side. In some. Yeah, let's see. I'm taking a TAM just in case. It is open. Wow. I mean, yeah, runner, but that's like not. That has nothing to do with bullets. Totally not gonna be cancer to that little No, I'm not talking about green tip. Like actual shrapnel fragmentation, yeah, that like that's very very deadly. But bullet fragmentation, like, is not a thing. That was just some made up bullshit in Tarkov to make it to where some of the nine by thirty nine ammo would just one tap you for no reason. You know, the 9x39 ammo that was tested by shooting a watermelon and it didn't penetrate it? I don't know if that's a teammate. Yeah, yeah that's a teammate. But the, there's plenty of cases of people surviving gunshot wounds. Like the, Getting shot one time is very, very, very much not fatal, almost always. Unless it hits something major. The humans are, in parts, stupidly fragile. But then, on the other hand, we also, on average, we also survive a lot of stupid shit. It's very, very, very rare to die to a single gunshot wound. Okay, yeah, so this plan didn't work mainly because I don't know this map enough. <laughs> So I'm like a lost puppy. 9 by 39 is the round that's loaded in the Asval and 9A91 and VSS. It's terrible. It's some Russian meme shit ammo. Yeah, I definitely don't know this map well enough to be anywhere. It doesn't uh, actually really have- it doesn't have good cross-map spots, it's like, for the most part, this map is actually not shit. Yeah. Warrior over there, I don't wanna just stare into their spawn, so I'm gonna cross and go behind them. Stomping to my left here. Warrior died. There was a fox just sitting there. Yeah, I... I have activated bot mode. So I don't know where I am. <laughs> oh yeah, and this is like a... Yeah, so I'm just gonna die. The SR2M uses, uh... 9 by 21 Like, Russia uses these weird-ass calibers that... Uh, I understand they don't want to use everyone else's standard ammo because they're stupid, but... They make these weird-ass calibers of these weird-ass guns that suck ass. Oh, you know what would be cool? If we just make all our guns out of stamped parts, so the tolerances suck. Yeah, it's cheaper. Okay. <laughs> well, that 
went not well, but not as, not as bad as I feared. Going into a building in a BT-1. <laughs> Like, Russia has actually developed extremely high-quality weapons, but they can't afford to produce them, so they There's get a the modern shit that they have, which is just garbage. The AK-12 is trash. One of the worst firearms in a modern military that's, like, a modern there gun. There we go. Nice see, Vixen. Like, everything Russia essentially do does is the same as Western uh, private military industry companies do. They, But they announce them as essentially service-ready, whereas in the West, it's this is a tech demonstrator. We can build this to your specs. Uh, there's an AA. Oh, I got hit once by a invisible tracer. That's awesome. By a ZA-35. But I have extinguishers, so fuck you, I'm going to the airfield. I had no idea where he was. But I'm sorry. You're fine, I saw his tracers. <laughs> okay, well, he didn't kill me and the tracers were visible to you, so we'll take it. They, they announce them as service ready in order to, and then hype up their qualities beyond the actual uh, capabilities that the vehicles have in order to drive export sales that then will actually fund the de development and product readiness of the vehicles. Like, that's how they've done it for the entirety of the fucking Cold War and now modern times. Like the problem AKM. is they're just running out of customers. The AKM and AK-47, like the actual Russian produced ones, were extremely high quality at the start. And then the Russian stuff started to be terrible, and then you wanted to get, I believe, Czechoslovakian ones. Yeah, that blue. That's what I mean. Like they just don't have customers anymore because the Middle Eastern dictators are starting to run out of money and funding them, funneling them towards something that isn't the T72. And India is kind of like we bought a shit ton of your T90s's and you haven't delivered half of them, so you can go fuck off. Also, not to mention all of the corruption in Russia. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Russia very easily could have a very good military, but there's so much corruption that, um, that's just, like, not possible anymore. I like how this dude is just auto rotating. Oh, yeah, now I see you on stream. <laughs> the Funacopter. Yeah.
I mean, it's the same thing as China. China and Russia are both memes. I said positive things about you. Pay up. China is absolutely <laughs> not different. <laughs> yeah. China has the same shit problems that Russia has, is, or has. They just haven't been involved in a conflict. They're honestly they're probably worse. The the fact that all of Chinese, uh, all of uh, China's uh, rocket engines were filled with oh water, yeah that <laughs> that that's unbelievable. That, and that was like Xi's crown jewel was the whole strategic missile force. Yeah. And then it comes out. Oh shit! Our guys are corrupt as shit as well. Who could have thought? Surprise. <laughs> oh shit! What is this? <laughs> and you have the problem where Chinese equipment is literally copies of oh, other nations' mad. equipment, but worse. There's a mad AA. Oh, I'm a. back to base. I've got 166 rounds. Okay. I should be fine. I'm gonna do a clickety clackety. Oh, I dropped on the completely wrong thing. That's not good. Also, that too. It does. Like, I would imagine China's missile boats also have the same problem with their missiles just malfunctioning if they ever tried to uh -huh. actually use them. They're, all their missiles on those boats are more than likely based off of Russian designs already, which already malfunction all the time and suck, so... But oh, you, what you've the got the Chinese copy version of it now, so it's just even worse. Oh, that video <laughs> that we, I posted earlier about the, uh, the Indian <laughs> missiles. Oh yeah, that, again, those are just Russian missiles. Oh, that's a meteor not a seahawk those are those are russian missiles that if, india is using if this meteor loses this dogfight to an alpha jet i'm going to revoke his gaming license hmm. and like the chinese <laughs> the chinese future soldier thing where they're allegedly gonna equip all of their infantry with the same stuff like america is supposed to have thermal optics and the new rifle and all that but I guarantee Are, that's never going to roll out. Oh, you mean something like how for the longest time China didn't even give body armor to their uh, soldiers <laughs> because the general that general thought it saps the fighting spirit. That sounds like uh anti anti-party narrative so your band and minus 5,000 social credit. Yeah, basically. <laughs> and the like suicide helmet thing. Oh, the the if you surrender, it kills you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it blows up. Or the. The, they're finding out that the helmets were packed full of explosives with a remote detonator. They, no one defined what kind of future warfare it was. Yeah. <laughs> Intro package for the soldiers. This allows the leadership to give you real-time information and it will keep you safe and inform them the battlefield. In reality... There's a, like, remote control car uh, receiver in it, and there's a guy sitting sitting in a bunker with a <laughs> detonator looking at looking at an incoming radio feed on a fax machine that's reporting no, no forward progress. Okay, random one of these is getting pressed. The commissar. <laughs> it beams the information directly into your brain. Oh, yeah. It's just too much for your brain to handle, so your head explodes. 
they had also, no one detonating them. It's uh, he didn't believe in the cause, so his yeah. bad thoughts caused him yeah. caused him to die. China's infrastructure and economy is also dog shit. What do you mean their concrete doesn't last for more than two months? What do you mean when you cook the books for 15 years, it eventually looks bad? Space for reversing. No, I just okay. wanted to. Yeah, 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 I'm just making sure that I'm blocking the fuck out of here. Okay, there's a very angry BMP2 right at this point. Oh, it's a BP2, so I can't really do that. I hold up on thing. Okay, that's my track gun. So, just back up. I'm gonna just hit yeah. the... Yeah, I'm just going around. Oh, um, I see. <laughs> you activated too many neurons at the same time, and he just exploded. Yeah. Two targets, that's too many, explodes. When he has an auto cannon that lol pits both of them. Oh, that was the wrong guy to shoot. Yep. Uh, it's a T-55 down to crew. Then to the right, there's a Bradley. Yeah, Bradley's looking. Like, the thing China has is the same thing Russia has. A lot of people who are, like, brainwashed by the state. Like, holy fuck, imagine if they actually had a functioning society and, like, a purpose-built military industrial complex that wasn't corrupt to shit. I.e. not run by humans. Like, we don't want <laughs> Society comes along with massively declining birth rates. Generally. Oh, yeah. You also so, can't make people work for like pennies on the month. Yep. They will fight you tooth and nail. <laughs> I'm gonna go fuck you. I'll sleep on the weekend. You mean you're paying me nothing for a deadly job? Uh, yeah, I think do this. That I could do for. Not nothing in a not this country. Yeah. Fuck you. What do you mean I have to climb into the reactor and go touch it <laughs> while it's on? What do you mean the spirit of Mazedong keeps me alive? Surely that is. Yeah, he kept pressing W the right amount. Uh, there is very, very angry AA. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Why am I anti-China? I'm not- it's not even anti-China, it's literally just the truth. The US has that same shit. It's just not as bad because our shit is like actually functional. But like congressmen and senators are... 
like, you should never be able to trade pu publicly. Like, you should never be able to work for a company you lobbied for. And you should never be able to interact with the stock market ever if you've worked in a uh, high position of power. There's a weasel inside, like, that concrete bunker or building house. In there somewhere, unless it got killed and I just didn't notice, which is definitely possible. Okay, so the amount of backup what oh I'm crashing block. That was too many too many backup ones increased with spawn protection for my alpha for alpha jet to handle. Lobbying absolutely should be illegal. It's basically bribing. Like, it's taking bribes. What do you mean, taking money when you're in a political state of office? Taking money from a private, private company to then push for a specific interest that they they prefer. That's totally fine. It's just smart business. And then once you retire, you get a position in that company as like executive <laughs> fucking donut eater paying 50,000 million trillion dollars a day. <laughs> executive <laughs> analyst. <Yeah>. Chief <laughs> advisor. Just had to shoot me like a million times. That was crazy. Lobbying has no purpose. It, it literally has no purpose. Like, I don't know why you always say shit like that. That's just fucking stupid. Lobbying is just legal bribes. There's no other reason for lobbying to exist. It's just like gerrymandering and cutting districts up in weird shapes. They serve no other purpose besides, like, meme shit. Fucking redistricting is so stupid. Oh man, we're at a... <laughs> the opposition has a 60% majority well if i just cut this up into the weirdest shapes possible then uh we win Are we yay spawning? i don't know it's a full down tier it's up to you it's low cloud cover european province no yeah i was thinking about vt1 things but then i saw low cloud cover <laughs> uh want to do top italy uh absolutely not but i will do 10 free USA. USA well, no, like Italy's well. fine. It's just that we're just getting fucked because the <laughs> areas are bad. It's not about banning political like campaign donations, but the like the thing is, the thing that I've always said is that if you do absolutely anything for a company or a company donates to you and you accept the donation, you should never be able to work with that company or any of its children or parent companies after you retire from office. You like you also should not be able to like I said the stock market that should not be allowed if you're in public office or after you've retired from public office. Oh, I got money from a company. I'm going to push a decision through and I'm going to buy stocks in advance that are going to be more valuable after I push this decision through. That's fine. Yeah, Nancy <laughs> Pelosi? Totally normal.
Yeah, definitely. Crew positions. Okay, so I spawned backwards. I represent uh, the Royal Guard of Oman, so clearly I am a better vehicle. Do you have under a premium one or something? Uh, yeah. Okay. Do I want to continue spading my non spaded one, or do I want to just have a spaded one? Now I have both in my lineup. Okay. Okay. You know, that uh, that was kind of stupid. I will take it though. My my gripping is cheaper now. I'll take it. Yeah, you should have seen I, how I hit him. I oh my god, I'm a, yeah, I'm bad. What is it? It's a T90M. And he uh, exploded. Yeah, there's a guy on the opposite side hills, like where. Whatchamacallit, the uh, fucking. Uh, the, 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 the. Yeah, well, he's scouted now. One, like, back right, and then there was another one like here. Yeah. So essentially, in, uh, I think of a rat spot there. There's a guy there. But that death was completely my fault. I've been getting lased through a uh, sand dune. Wow, that's a very high-powered laser. Yeah, I, I played like a bot because I went over the wrong sand dune. I remembered incorrectly which one to crest, so I ate shit, as deserved. <laughs> Oh no, wait, it's the game's fault. Fuck the game. Jesus Christ, I did everything right. Oh, yeah, me and uh, Shay were memeing about that as long path of exile. Oh, there's a guy staring at our spawn next to a teammate. Oh, now the 122 pushes him. Yeah, me and Shay were playing Path of Exile, and uh, we were dying to the game, and, or we were dying to, like, shit that we were doing. It's like, we need to blame the game for this. We did this wrong, but it's the game's fault. Yeah. There was a guy sitting there, right next to three of our teammates. He was just fine. And now this teammate is spamming me with machine guns. Like, that's part of the reason why modern video gaming is so shiz. There's no personal accountability. There's no way I could have done this wrong, even though it was entirely wrong and everything I did was wrong in the whole- Oh, and I've been hit by a chrysanthemum. Yeah, well, there is a chrysanthemum there as well. Yeah, I'm dead. I'm, I'm leaving. I, wait, I made one mistake, and after that, my game was over. Yeah. Because people play this like rats. Uh, scout drones kind of have lasers still. Oh. Please don't have heard me. Oh, yeah. There's like. Thank God. There's four of them what? in three different spots uh, across the like wrong side. Just sitting there. What? Dude, there is so much camping, man. Why? Yep. I, I, I don't understand it. Like, how and why? Like, there were three guys on the enemy team, at least, who, from the start of the match, drove away from the objective behind their spawn to sit there staring at angles that are past the He just rammed my fucking rotors
this is a that match was a perfect example of why a tank only mode why tank only modes will never be viable And hello, Giotto. Oh, people who want a tank only mode are delusional. Like, I don't. People. <laughs> Did you play during the tank only test? No, but I bet it was awesome. No, it was fucking trash. It was some of the worst gameplay you've ever seen ever in any video game. The first day was great. Everyone yeah. pushed around and played the game and it was fun. And then it's like, oh, wait. You lose doing that if you're bad. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to have sex with this corner. That's mm. why I want the option, like, I want several more uh, queue options. Like, I want an option where you can select a queue into clear weather only. I want the people who want the tank only mode to just have their tank only mode so they can see what a better and shithole it is. And, I mean, there still will be people who absolutely fucking love it, which, I mean, hey, you do you then, but it will be a barren wasteland after a month there's gonna be like 10 hardcore people queuing for it and no one else and they just sit still competitively but you wanted a tank only mode because you never understood how bad it would be like once people realize how shit that would be they stop wanting it Like, yeah, like that I mean, map, for example. Like, if we, our team hadn't left and we got into air, we could have cleared out those guys from the spots. But because we didn't get air, there was no... We just had no chance of countering them because there were four guys with lines of sight into our spawn. Yep. So and I was, was the over. only one who made it through, and I can't fight that yeah. many people by myself. Yeah, because then there's the other people who weren't behind their spawn who can then really combat the space. shot the one spot where I don't die, so I'm already counting my blessings and just leaving. I'm just gonna bring an unloaded G91. I have no interest in respawning on the ground on that map. Yeah, you're, you're fine. Like that spot, that line of sight should not be on that map. Okay, so I thought a teammate smoked that crossing. Nope, he smoked so that the enemy still sees through it. 
so I couldn't see the enemies in that crossing, but they could still see through. It's not even about killing people you can't front pen. That has nothing to do with it. It's about killing people in weird spots, watching weird sight lines that there's no counterplay to. If you can't pen someone, that's almost always a player issue. I can't actually really think of an instance where there's something that you can fight that you can't pen, except maybe some 6-7s versus the mouse or something. That's a 163 or a 901. There's two in that spawn. Okay. Yeah. This is most certainly an AA. It's a 163 and a Shulka. Or a Yenisei. Alright. Uh, I had a momentary distraction from uh, real life. Oh, he's shooting at me. They're all shooting at me. 163 is uh, down to two. Yeah, Shilka shooting me. I dropped, but I'm out of the ouchies. Ow. There's a WZ on my mark. I'm RTP. My aircraft's locked. Yeah, I'm coming to RTP as well. I got hit by one of them without tracers, though, so, you know, XD. Fighting those alone. Ow, I see. I guess I'm not RTPing. The no tracer Shilka hit me from the, the WZ finished me up. <sighs> I mean, yeah, that's my fault for flying straight, but I wouldn't have flown straight if I saw any tracers near me. Yep. Just let me know when you're taking off, I'll bring a backup alpha jet. Hmm. Don't feel like using words. I'd rather continue spading this thing. Uh, the WZ was like uh, at the outer edge. Behind there, yeah. On the, on the cancer building. Oh, he's on the cancer <laughs> building. The one that yeah. shouldn't even be on the map. Uh, I wish Gaijin would, like, for example, give you map editing tools, but the only thing you would have would be the painted as out of bounds tool. Yep. And that, like, without all this garbage they're doing to change the maps, you could, like, any player who actually is good and has played for an excessive amount of time with everything, would be able to fix 90% of the maps that way. Yep. this map. Just putting the, both of the bitch houses on both sides out of bounds would make this map 40% better. Oh yeah. Like that's an arbitrary number but it's in the ball ballpark. Like the change they made to that top side spawn actually just made the game map play out worse to an extent. if they killed the WZ yet. Yeah. 
can't see him. Uh, there's a P47 low. Stalin bolt. I think they killed him. Yeah, there's a corpse there. I hear a jet as well. Yeah, that's a yeah, jet flying past me. A MiG-15 and a second jet as well. I'm following the MiG. Fifteen. How do you play? Turn. Hmm. That's my own fault to an extent. But I expected that Saab to, to, you know, do anything. me right uh give me a second like if, if you're in a hurry you can play one without but i should be like less than five minutes all right Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Uh, returning has been completed. 
Welcome back. Only like 20k left for the Zister, and then I can start using the Tam. <laughs> A map of all time. Oh my god. Crew positions. Seven China and uh, eight seven France yesterday. Ooh, the molding was hard. <laughs> the teammates, they they were definitely teammates. And then when every match is bad weather, so like half of my nations were crew lock permanently. Also didn't help that once you get tilted you just play like well not play like shit but you care less so you don't pay attention and then you end up dying to stupid shit because you're not paying attention. Yeah. Uh, you need help on that corner or you good if I peek here. I don't even see anyone over here. Guy is on another one. No, no, another one. Like close the cap. Crazy, you pinged where he was and he uh, died. It's so weird. How could that ever happen? You're cheating. There was no way you could know where he was. And now we go to B. It's just amazing how much a little bit of communication goes in this game. Yeah. And no one fucking does it. is having a moment, but he's still flying. I've hit him with all three calibers of weapons I have. <laughs> he's still flying. There's someone middle. On the yeah, side. that's... Oh, I'm sorry. What? Okay, uh... Yeah, that guy. Wait a second, my turret's turning. It's a seven. Oh, yeah. You so killed him. Yeah. He is not alive. Yeah. He's turning my turret and then he unexisted. So where's my thermals? Okay, so I'm just not gonna shoot M60s with the 105 anymore because apparently the 30mm APHE works better against them. Yeah, shoot him in the uh, yeah. the meme spot on there, Capola. Oh yeah, <laughs> that that is the tool I've been using because the fucking main gun isn't working. Imagine if you had a uh, L7 with darts instead of an L7 with the APTS. Oh yeah. No, that's, uh, I might actually uh, like flying uh, that. <laughs> Put it at nine zero. Give it darts. <laughs> Everything's fixed. Everyone loves that thing. I, just, I found it to be very average. Yeah, because it's it's the uh, term free. Oh. 
Because it, it just... It's very forgiving. It does nothing amazingly. It's just... Middle of the line, easy to use. So I'm going to get like 14 kills here in a second if they push, if it's a push on to see. Because definitely didn't put artillery directly on top of it. people all around me. Oh, there's a fucking locust. Oh wow, how'd that happen? What the helicopter? Oh no. I wanna see it. it. it, 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 it. Seven smoke zits in the corner. Yeah, I just blind fired him and shit. Nice. On the other side of the spot. Yeah. Oh. But there's just smoke everywhere, so I see nothing. Oh. One way yeah, smoke, man. And yep, one way smoke. I couldn't see him, he could see me. Just as I came around the corner, he killed me, of course. I mean, it doesn't matter anything to anyone anyways. The only reason I'm playing this crap is to get in the alpha jet. Yeah. One oh five and thirty mil APHEs into a Shilka, nothing. One twenty three mil into a term explodes. Whatever. I just want the spaded loadout for this thing. Just having the four spaced out drops is not not that great. Well, at least this thing has the good gun. Flying privileges are revoked. Man, having to uh, rifle caliber or having two 50 cals is uh, pretty bad. Uh, having a Mauser 27 mil is pretty good. Jeez, if only, man. <laughs> Imagine two of those on a G91. I'd fly nothing else. One in each spawn. No, two, two, in spawn. two here, yeah. one on the other spawn. Yeah. Just one six three spawn. Well. Yeah. Should be dead. Assuming they're out of spawn probe by now. Yeah. A is hugging each other. We love it. Yeah. You got it or? He's in spawn pro. Is that is that a few uh, Israeli that a few in the Yeah you shoot. 
there's a heli below me as well. Oh, he just got shot down. Oh, he's shooting at me. That fucking bitch. Dude. Why is he still shooting at me? Like, what the fuck? <laughs> I guess he's just mad because I killed this moment. I think that's a BTRZD next to him. And he hit me! I was maneuvering that entire time. It's a level 27. Who has 70 deaths and 3 air kills in the ZSU 57-2. I thought that was allied because there was no enemy shooting at me. The amount of times I get hit by like turbo shitters with lucky shots like that is obscene. Like, my favorite was when a guy who had 400 and something deaths in a duster and two air kills hit me when I was in a, can't remember, probably G91, and I was three and a half kilometers away. <laughs> I was like, okay. Are we going through C or? Yeah, I guess. Uh, yeah, I'll take the town. I was gonna take the VT, but I'll just get my am there. Yeah, I have to spawn the fucking term still for a game or two. Positions. Ready up. Ready. Ready. I swapped my main route to PDFS because APDS has been hitting me with the heavy let me downs today. APDS is very I also like how it changes from patch to patch. <laughs> oh. Because last patch, the 105 APDS was actually like decently usable. So a prime example of how, how Gaijin just doesn't want to put in effort is that they added this thing but did not bother modeling in the one thing that makes this thing unique. The free axis stabilization. Term free, the ball mount. The whole gimmick of the thing was that it has a free axis stabilization. Well, what about the uh... What about 
What about that, uh, the thing for yeah. oscillating turret that they added, uh, into Germany and France? Um, the Curacier. Oh, the Skidfiz thingy and the, uh, the Japs? Yeah, 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 that thing. And, uh, it, uh, right here. it now has no stabilizer at all. Yeah, but that uh. sucks. What? Please kill this guy. I'm around the corner. Oh. Yeah, I did. I assume that there's another one. Yep, I don't have a turret ring. Okay. They hadn't pushed for so long that I just decided that I'm gonna push them then. And that guy just got turbo mega fucked over. He shot me in the ass with a T-55. Well, they shot me in and the it... face and it bounced, and I uh, shot them and it bounced, because this game is fucking garbage. Yep. And this cloud is insane. If I hit the mountain, I'm leaving. Okay. Oh, it's Storm. That's great. You'll be able to dive out of the cloud. There's... The... Do you want at the mountain? Yeah, it's, it spawns, like, to the left of the mountain. No, the, the cloud is almost over the mountain, but if you dive out yeah, no, of the no, cloud, no, but I meant spawn, the man. air air spawn that is. No, if, if I dove right off of spawn, I would have hit, like and just flew straight, and the cloud was covering oh. the mountain. I would have hit the mountain. Oh, that's cool. That's great. We love that. Oh, there's still one more sitting here. <laughs> of course there is. He was sitting like hugging the church. He had his engine off and he was hugging the church. Love that. Oh, that that wasn't a good enough hit. Good. Good. <laughs> I hope this is far enough that I don't hit the mountain. I am in the void. If you just dive out from the first cloud you spawn in, you won't hit it. Yeah. There is a uh, AMX 30 DCA firing at me here. Yeah. I'll do a gun run from below. Uh, left spawn, yeah. Yeah. I'll dive from the left and do a gun run. If he keeps looking at you. Oh, there's one in both spawns. There's also one. He's not actually in spawn. See the other one anymore? This is fucking ridiculous. There's air on me. I might need shit here. Oh, he's shooting at me still. That's right there. Yeah. Dumbass. Dude. The other one's here. This one. No, you know. Not fuck. Yeah, I went too far left. I thought it was his one. Yeah, the air is angry at you. It's a prop. Yeah, but he's got A and M's, which are. Very scary. Yeah. Just get the AA. I don't give a shit about this prop. Okay. AA should be dead unless he figured out what the W key is. Fuck. Just didn't. He figured out what the W key is, but didn't press it more than for half a second. The air is still alive on the right. He's like over here somewhere. I lost him because. Shitty render. Oh, I see him now. He's over there, uh, like over there. A side spawn. Oh, I see him. There might be angry backup DCAs. Maybe. I don't think so. I haven't seen any yet. But... That's a tempest. I crit him. Okay, so I broke the engine of an AML and an Object 906 into the other spawn. <laughs> the APH didn't do anything else. But yeah, they're right next, well, not right next to each other, but three kills. Uh, there's another prop on me. I'm dead. Yeah, it's a, it's a French Corsair. I, I had zero energy. Oh, you sure got me. Oh 
my god, dude. I love no audio. So great. I'm about to just use the R3. This is, I hate, I hate 50 cals on jets. When you only have two, it's just useless. Oh, and then his wing just explodes. Okay. Okay. <laughs> very, RRT very consistent. Like this disintegrated. Yeah, it sounds about right. I like how there was zero audio, and then when I had zero energy, suddenly out of the cloud appears A and M's. Yeah. Shoot a Yenisei to death with uh, 50 cows. Uh, what the French guy respawned again, so either he's in the clouds or back up DCA would be my guess. Oh, Yenisei. Another one. Oh, he hit me. Oh, spawn prone still. Cool. I hate... Like, dude is dog shit. Then gets a backup with infinite spawn probe. And now I'm dead as well. Not yet, but... Coming back within the 91. Yeah, I'm just... Trying to keep distance, but... Uh... He's still just shooting. A horde tent that doesn't care about it might be going for him. No, he's just oh, keep shooting me. Oh, he hit me from three and a half kilometers out while I'm dodging. Well, I'm not dead, but that is exceedingly irritating. He's still just full left click bottom down. He's about to run out of ammo, like he hasn't let go of the trigger this entire time. Oh, I'm dead. There's a plane on me. I don't know what it is. Oh, he's not going after you, I don't think. Single drops? What? I still don't know where the plane is. I, he's in the clouds somewhere. I just hear him. Well, uh, in a second, I was expecting to get rid of more than that in one. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I'm not going fast enough. That was a good use of an orb. Yeah, I should have just Okay, him. I found him. It's a Bator. Going over there, A side spawn now. And then there's a second plane that's a prop of some sort. Yeah, but there's the Bator. Who is consistently the friend. Oh, cool. Why does he start turning towards me? He fully de rendered. Oh, now he's past me already. That mark coming towards you. Oh, oh I see. What the hell? Pulley. Yeah, like. And another prop and a heli.
getting lost to these bots. Not necessarily. Our team's on C. They can. Oh, DK. are they on C? Yeah. Okay. okay. Couldn't see any on C. Try DCA and find 40 this is heli. firing at me. Or DCA 30, sorry, not DCA 40. DCA 40 would be like, you know, manageable. <laughs> yeah, oh, okay. Nice. <sighs> Fucking nice. I definitely 100% deserve that. Part 20 of non-rendering shit hitting us. Mm -hmm. That's great. Oh, he's the last guy. Big RTB. Uh, I'm taking a quick break after this. Yeah. I'll be back in like... Source of entertainment. It is the greatest circle jerk of cast bad. Okay, yeah, that match is ending, so I will BRB in like 10. Taking a breather from the bullshit. <laughs> I'll catch you in a bit. in a minute also I'm gonna go and check something.
All right, I'm back. Oh, I know Welcome what I'll back. do. I'll fucking hate myself. Hell yeah. I love, I love hating myself. Yeah, I don't have a, I don't have a phantom. Or I guess I could use the F forever early, but it's not talisman. I could use a lazure and like extra hate myself. See this thing that Vonner posted. What the fuck? What is this dumbass coat? Tiger 2H is under tiered because the Jumbo is 6'3 and the Tiger 2 is better. Okay. The Tiger 2H is, uh. That's already a higher than that. Yeah, it, it is, but they want it to go higher because they're stupid. I can fight the Tiger 2H in my tank if I get an up tier. Not allowed. And then someone brought up that the Sherman has a stabilizer and uh, it makes it better than the Tiger in most situations. And I was like, well, it doesn't matter. The Tiger doesn't have to aim. Okay. Oh, right. Okay. base of this game is really something else. So I have AS Nords instead of AA Nords. Boy, I sure am glad I can see the C Vixen in my G91. That's, that's really fun. This is such a fun BR when you're in a subsonic. And then there's a MiG-17 which just absolutely shits on me.
Oh yeah, right, this piece of shit is an A9B, so the seeker is caged. Wow, yay, wow, that's that's so cool. Wow, that's that's fun. What a what a fucking great game mode, man. Era be so fun. People actually play this shit to, like, enjoy themselves. That's crazy. Let's put the right fucking missile on so I can kill that dipshit in the head on this time. Instead of dying to his fucking shit a, like, minute later. Because he's twice as fast as me with missiles that I can't dodge. Oh, Starfighters. Yeah, that's that's a comparable vehicle. That's something I should see. Just so we're clear, I just got a hit marker on that guy with a, uh, a yes mark. Oh my god. Why did he do that? Oh my god.
Fuck it. I'm just gonna do the brain off shit. I'm gonna just not play the game. Let's go. Oh, I brought a gun. Shit, I don't want a gun. Oh well. Oh, the gun's integral, right? Why do I have so much fuel? Oh, I hate rocketing bases, but it's a hell of a lot better than playing that dog shit ass G91. Okay, I'm fucking team killing this dude.
That hit me? What? I'm so glad the F5 is so unbelievably tanky. That really, uh, that really improved my gameplay a lot when I just shot the shit out of him and nothing happened. Am I actually going to get minimum fuel? Is it going to happen? Do I get to actually get there first this time? I'll do the alpha jet. Hey, hey, I'm in fuel. Sick. Absolutely not, it's not talisman. Because I have zero interest in playing a MiG-21 at 11.0 with R60Ms. Unlike all the other random shitters, my R60s don't just ignore flares, so... I don't even have the tornado. Hello, Andrew. But you're missing out, Shiz. Oh yeah, dude, I can do what I'm doing right now, but worse. Wow. That's so fun. <laughs> yeah, dude.
I'm so glad this guy is deciding to do this. Dude, he got me, man. He uh, he ruined my fun by wasting my time for like one minute as I just draw him 13 kilometers away from the AO and then just slam into the ground and go next. He uh, he got me. He really uh, really showed me what's up. Oh, I don't know. I might be able to use R13s, but. Whatever. Nothing's actually wrong with my hands. I mean, they're like a little achy, but it's whatever. Tingling. Okay, I've committed the return. Welcome back. I uh, got chased by someone for like a really long... Not really, but I got chased by someone in the uh, Phantom. To, for no reason, I just ran out of fuel and slammed into the ground. It's like, dude, you, you got me, man. He sure showed you. Yeah, man. I just should fuck leave the game and get in the Lazur and go next. Oh, man. He, he got me. Oh, no. How could you ever do that?
Okay, now, flyer people. What What's the good thing about the R-13s? Like, is it, it's the extended range, and they're fast, right? I mean, or... they get flared off, though. Like, they're just like every yeah, other like, shitty yeah. IR missile. They're like very that... similar to, uh... They're very similar to AIM-9Js, but they they go further. Okay, yeah, like that. That was because I understand the core core base behind them. Uh, Stellar, not really. But yeah, I, I was just wondering what the fuck the like purpose behind them is. A reasoning for using them over our 60s, for example, is uh, they they just go further than our 60s. That's about it. Right. They maneuver they maneuver slightly worse, but they go further. Yeah, it's like using an A9P or an A9J. Mucho apreciado. See, you had a speed related whoopsie. Yeah, whatever. Has Worth undertaken over a World of Tanks in popularity? Uh, probably, because World of Tanks did like everything they could to fuck up their game. I think they did a long time ago. Like worldwide population, yeah. The main advantage that uh, War Thunder has is that the uh, server, you can play on any server you want on your account. That is a huge issue with World of Tanks. Like, all the World of games is the region lock servers. Yep. A big problem with that, though, is all the, uh... Although they are on the, uh, NA version of, uh, World of Tanks as well. Like, all you have to do is just go to the website. World of Tanks, all you have to do is just go to the website for that region-specific version of World of Tanks and download the game from there. Well, yeah, but if you want to change you... servers, but it it obviously won't bring your account over. You'll, you'll have to start another account on that game, which is like but, the huge problem. Yeah, but then a pro huge problem with the way War Thunder is is you're literally just constantly playing with Chinese people all the time. I mean, yeah, but that's every game. Like that, that's not a that doesn't matter. War Thunder is less accessible overall. Like it's too the interest well, for it more, is way more of a learning curve. Yeah, it's more well, niche. Whereas Rock I don't know, is man. a lot more arcadey. Fucking, it, it's more arcadey, but they they made the armor models and roll the tanks so fucking dumb, man. Yeah, They're... but the thing about World of Tanks, like excluding all of that, the visual feed for people watching is much more entertaining entertaining, yeah. and you can tell what the fuck's going on in this yeah. game like I fly around or I just fucking snapshot someone the people watching don't even see it's like what is that like what the fuck was that yeah. aircraft yeah. destroyed okay aircraft destroyed <laughs> dude oh or he's already killed him okay yeah like this game has zero good viewer feedback No, like, something just... that could be cool, like, they'd have to reprogram the entire game, but if you could do, like, a stream with a delay of 
three minutes or something with sensor view that viewers could watch that would make this game have a lot more popularity if like viewers at any point could swap between the views and see what's going on yeah it would like get the like overhead essentially tournament view yeah when they wanted which would require like a full-on new ui and shit ton of coding which gaijin isn't doing but that would make it more accessible I mean, there'd also have to be a big delay for people playing the game. Like, oh this yeah, absolutely. Because yeah. otherwise, you just stream it so you get wall hacks. <laughs> but I mean, this World of Tanks will always be a more viewed game than War Thunder because anyone can hop into a World of Tanks stream and pretty much know what's going on. You have someone hop into a War Thunder stream and it's just like, what? Like, what? What would you get out of the information right now? I have extended information, so you can see that I have fuel, how fast I'm going, my indicated airspeed, and my weaponry. Other than that, you've got some circles, you've got some contrails, you've got some flashing fucking dicks over there, and that's it. It's a grid in front of you as well. Uh, yeah. The flashing dicks. That's, uh... That's really the, uh most pertinent information yeah but i mean if someone hops in like what do they see they see some fucking shapes and that like yeah wow not to mention all the mods there are for all the tanks that uh can give you give you even more information oh yeah like world of tanks is just a much better game for from the viewer perspective Oh, a Kafir Canard, okay. Oh, a dipshit teammate is the one who did it. Okay, that explains why I died. Oh yeah, you went for bases that he marked! Yeah. <laughs> I forgot, being in the faster plane means I should just wait for his stupid ass. Oh yeah. Thank God. World of Tanks users are not younger than, or neither of the viewer bases, um, yeah. I think it's probably like the same average age across both games, like I, I don't really think one's younger players than the other. Yeah. It's definitely not. Like the spread is similar. But it's just all about accessibility. Like, viewer accessibility, anyone, if you're even remotely decent, can get a large following on World of Tanks. It doesn't really matter on War Thunder, because not enough people watch it, because watching this game is shit. One big thing I have for watching streams like why is here, I always have your stream muted. And I just listen to the voice comms, because... The game audio is so important, so if you have a stream on that has the game audio, it'll confuse your own game and you'll be fucked because of it. Yeah, like in World of Tanks, if you can have fucking the loudest shit you want playing, and it doesn't matter because everything is visual, you you don't get to sound or people in World of Tanks because the game isn't set up like that. Well, if you don't have something like a vehicle spotted with the game spotting mechanics, then it just literally won't make audio and it won't, won't even appear. Well, I mean, existence. yeah, but like World of Tanks also has the uh, uh, like automatic spotting range when you're close to someone, it will just automatically spot them no matter what. Stellar, that's big, that's because the game play itself is built to f frustrate you into paying money to progress, so people will rather not get that frustrated and watch someone have the stuff they would want to play so they want get to see it being played without having to go through that frustration to do it themselves and then people like people watching people be frustrated for some reason and base bombing is extraordinarily effective at grinding if i had a talisman that last game would have been worth 10,000 rp for doing nothing The 
especially if you have rocket loads. Like it, it's just mind bogglingly yeah. effective. If you have a phantom, your RP per game is insanely high for doing literally nothing. Killing bases and then dying. Yep. You kill bases, get as many kills as you can, and then die, or you just RTB and get more bases. Oh yeah, and I just realized another reason why the uh, French Alpha is a lot worse. It uses snibs instead of Mighty Mice, so... It's like, what, half the explosive mess oh or some God, shit like that? Oh my God, that's terrible, yeah. Uh, yeah, so, like, even though still the best loadout for it is the four bombs in the inner pylons and the rockets for AA utility, but it's so much less, so much worse than it is to use the French one, or uh, German one with, uh, well, for one, the Mauser, and then two, the Mighty Mice. Like, if it was the other way around, that the difference was that the French one used Mighty Mice and then had the Defa, and the German one had the Mauser and Snebs, it would be more ba more equal in which one is worse. But this way, the French one is just a flat downgrade for ground. For air, I understand the argument that the Defas are more reliable and that you can get them as Gunpots so you don't have to get it in the, like, belly. Uh, the gondola. So you can get two of them on wing mounts, and they're more reliable for hitting. I hate Defos. Or one shotting. I do. I'd rather use the Mauser. The Mauser slams. The Defo oh, can yeah, fucking blow really me. Really fucking good, I... dude. <laughs> when I used it on that uh, on the uh, event uh, tornado when I was uh, grinding out Germany's top tier planes while bombing. <laughs> uh, the, uh, the, that cannon is insane. Oh, it, it, like, it, it kills planes instantly. Note the term, the argument, the terms, the argument can be made, and I can <laughs> see it. I, I can never see the argument for defos, man. I can't stand defos. The I only so advantage much. that defos have is that the ammo lasts longer. Dude, what really is this? What is I... this? It's fucking void, dude. I'm in Silent Hill. <laughs> that that means nothing to me when I just one tap planes with well, the, the fucking Mauser. I've, I've, I've gotten a few hits, but if there's any armor on the plane, it just detonates because it gets hit by the APHC and fuses it. It like just kills <laughs> planes so fast. The Defas, I'll I'll literally in the uh, the Kafir Canard, uh, I'll just dump into a plane sometimes, <laughs> and it just. It's just a bunch of criticals. Just parts are flying off the plane everywhere, but it's nothing enough to kill it. <laughs> You're just competitively dismantling it. Uh, yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, and I'm officially a Brazilian shaman placing curses on people in Twitch chat. In a finish. Okay. Speaking of competitive dismantling. Oh, I hate the Vulcan. It does that so much for me. Yeah. And then I have people saying, I've never gotten a hit with a Vulcan. Oh, what? Oh, the Vulcan used to be like a one shot with everything, but it's Oh yeah, it's when the trash. TNG was yeah. launched. It's been all over the place. So they yeah. at first when they put it in, it was shit, and then they buffed the fuck out of it and it was insane, and then they nerfed it again, and they buffed it again, they nerfed it again, and now I think it's at an okay spot right now. Wasn't I haven't played a first, plane in a long time. Wasn't the first thing that had it the T two and yes. on on launch no. it was like no, the the Phantom had it first. Was the Phantom at it before the T two? No. Was it? Believe. I don't think so, because yeah, the T two was like the god plane. Uh, yeah, that that's what my memory is as well. Let me, I'll check. Uh, do do do. The T two was added and Japan was OP for one patch, and then it just was shit after that. The T two got dumpstered immediately. It was very funny. Uh. T2 was 1.87, Phantom was 1.91, so yeah. It... Alright. 
but yeah, because I, that's my memory that on launch the Vulcan was like Turbo Destroyer 7000, then it got nerfed to the ground, and then it became the Destroyer again after a while. I mean, something special about the T2 when they added it as well as it had predictive... Uh, oh, the lead indicator. Locked, yeah, when you locked onto something with the fucking... with the radar, it would give you a lead indicator. It did that for everything too, so the F six or the F six F five N would have a uh, radar <laughs> leading gun oh, sight. Yeah. <laughs> and then they went, uh like that's the one of the rare occasions where Gaijin went, Okay, so this is too passive and easy. We're we're kinda going nope for this. And it was it was accurate. If you fired oh, in that yeah. middle, you they were done. <laughs> Straight you to shoot the void. The circle, they go. It had perfect accounting for lead and adjustment of uh, like speed as well. Yeah, it would it was update like the in real time. Marker on crack. It was so good, and then they're like, "Wow, this is dumb," and got rid of it. <laughs> mm. Is it worth the grind to grind with the Lazur to get cast planes? Uh, yes. If you have the Lazur, like, I don't go out and buy the Lazur, but if you have the Lazur, it's fine. Um, you're better off just talismaning random shit grinding through the tree. That's always what I, when people go, should I buy this to get the whole tree? No, it, like, especially if they're speaking for ground specifically. Like, it's always better to go through the tree and periodically talisman stuff than it is to get one top tier premium and burn through the whole tree with that. I mean, it depends. Why do I have this weird white, like, fuzzy stuff on the outside of my plane? Uh, what is this? It's it's mist condensing on your plane. It's realistic. Excuse me? If I look this, if I look this way, it's there. If I rotate, it, like, goes away. Okay. <laughs> You've got like the anime, this is a moving object outlines versus background image. Yeah. Oh my god. It's tier dependent, Zulu. So, like, if you were going to grind German air, uh, I need to play one more game of air. Or we okay, get yeah, yeah, you're, you're fine. Um, I would do the HE100 deep. I wouldn't even talisman anything here, honestly. Like, if you have premium account, you can grind this shit out. Like, every vehicle takes one game. Um, just get to the HE100 D1, and you can use this to get to the 109 F2, and then use that, and you can use that to grind out to the F4, and then you can use the F4 to just grind out all this stuff to the K4 and the G6. Like playing Germany ground or German air in ground is actually really efficient as long as you have the right vehicles for the right PR. Whereas honestly, I don't think the Lazur is a very good grinder. Okay, it's all the job done, but like... it's no phantom. You can't just go AFK and get like that last game right there. If I had a talisman, that would have been twenty four thousand RP. I did nothing. I, I blew up two bases and killed one guy and a couple AI. Yeah, that was something that when we were figuring out for the air event, the quickest way to get it done. Like the German Phantom, I had a talisman on it from back in the day. Then when we figured out how obnoxious the strat can be, I finished out the German tech, like the German air superiority stuff that I'd been struggling with for... <gasps> while because i couldn't be asked to play anything to finish it off because it was just taking it would have taken an obnoxious amount of time it that was done in like maybe eight hours of gameplay total and that was both of the mig 29s yep i mean you could just see right now what i'm doing like this is insanely easy rp and i'm not even really playing the game I mean, I am playing the game, but not really. I really wish they would fix the uh, the Cormorans. They would be so funny. <laughs> like, and also, if I were to bring two less racks of rocket pods, um, 
it's even faster, and you're guaranteed to get a base every time, no matter what. That's that's the trade-off. Like if you bring just one set, you are guaranteed. Like even if you eat dirt, you're guaranteed eight thousand RP. And then if you have a talisman and don't eat dirt, fifty to twenty. And if you bring both sets and there isn't competitive base destruction, which is the current meta, you're guaranteed like 20 to 30k per game. Yep. And I mean, you can get insane RP by just, like, you do your run, get your base, turn around immediately and go get more. All that matters is time, really, if you're base yeah. bombing. You just need time. I think the highest amount I got, because usually it, the game is game is over after the initial engagement. One side steamrolls the dogfight, and then there's one or two enemies remaining on the other side who gets who get hunted down, and that depending on how long that takes defines where you fall on the RP earned spectrum. But then there are those few games where both sides only have like two or three guys remaining and all need to re RTB, where you get to do like two or three runs. And that is when you get a metric shit load of RP for and doing nothing. Then there's the super rare games where it ends up being like a 1v1 and you're both in strike aircraft that can bomb bases. So you just don't shoot each other and just go kill bases all game for like yeah. 10 then minutes. You, then, you, then you look at when the AIs seem to be getting to the point where they're actively shooting each other and the tickets are going incrementally down because of that. And then you go kill the other guy. Yep. Because the game's going to end anyways. Yeah. I think the highest amount I managed, with a talisman, mind you, so it's slightly skewed, was... I think I sent... No, I didn't send you a screenshot of that one, but I think it's... 78,000 without a booster, but with a talisman. I mean, you also don't rocket bases, Zoom. Like, I'm not trying to like win this game if i was trying to win this game i would have sparrows on <laughs> i'm absolutely <laughs> not trying to win this i'm just look look at that guy in chat on your team <laughs> oh i know it the, the the a10 was like shooting at him or something so he killed him i bought i bought the f5c to have fun i am not having fun Oh, that, yeah. <laughs> no, air, air, air grind is, like, it's tedious, but it's easy. Like, we did the Hungarian air tree on launch by just talking shit in chat while going XD pencil. Oh, I missed the fucking... I should have just YOLO'd the base completely. I should have just flew straight into it and denied the kill. God damn it. Snooskungen. I think that's Swedish for like the uh, bagged chewing tobacco, and kungen is a meme term for the king. Here, I'll bring the correct load for YOLOing since I only need one base, anyways. You're bringing the Samele Himbala Bilhimbala Lola load up. Oh yeah, it's boring as fuck to do this, but that doesn't matter. Like, you can watch movies. The entire time I was grinding this, like the air event, I was watching movies on the other screen. Yeah. Yeah, for Russia, because they don't have a similarly effective vehicle as like the Phantom. They're either too slow or too susceptible to interception and don't, don't have enough payload at that point. The ML is like the plane for them because it is so obnoxiously good with well, the 24 the, Rs. The fucking J-Band bullshit radar yeah. <laughs> with 24 Rs is like, it, it's so dumb. It's, it's like two free kills no matter what you do. And they made that radar insane. It just sticks now.
Like, that's what I did for the German tornado, was I talisman the 23 MLA, put on the 24 Rs, and more or less picked my nose competitively and still spaded it in like 20 games. While losing every one of them and holding like a 2 KD without actually trying at all. In... Not really stellar. It's all about how much of a rat you can play in the rat aircraft. There's a lot of weird rat shit you can do in Air RB. Like spawn spitfires and just space climb and then boom and zoom. There's not really that much skill involved, it's just... It's definitely more skill than just spamming uh, phoenixes from orbit. Don't no question about that, but it's not pure skill by any metrics. Yeah, exactly what Zoom is saying. Being able to fight multiple people at one time effectively when your aircraft isn't just a god aircraft is where it actually requires you to have a brain cell. You're playing the band map. Five is sure gonna be happy about. Oh no, he has the rockets as well. I mean, he apparently didn't have enough to break it, so I just finished it off. Which, <laughs> whatever, that's not my problem. Oh yeah, because it can only run like that at max four pods. So if he, yeah, he couldn't get a single bomb uh, base with. Uh, just the rockets, so he has the inner bomb load. Yeah. Uh. It's just, I, like, I could do that every game in prop tier, it's just boring. I hate playing like that, I hate playing passive, so I just end up getting into dog bites I shouldn't take and then dying. Yeah, that's why I don't play prop ARB, it's just way too passive and boring. Like, the downtown mid-time is too much for my ADHD. Like, I don't actually have ADHD, but, like... Yeah, I mean, it's why in tanks I die a lot, when I could have way better KDs, because I just push. Yeah, like, I, I care more about having action in the game I'm spending my free time playing, rather than internet numbers being good. The only stat I really care about... I, I okay, he rendered. Um is win-loss ratio. Yeah. You know, I'm not gonna do that. I have one minute of fuel left. I just don't find playing for KD like that funny or fun. That's like that's like when I ever die or whenever I lose a game in the Sheridan, I'll uh, play it a lot more. With the seventy six Sheridan, but my win yeah. rate in it is currently at one hundred percent. So, you know, my oh, the only stat I care about is the KV two twenty, because I hate playing it, and now I have an excuse to never touch it again.
Andrew, if you're asking about why I don't like it, it's because I don't like heavy tanks in like in general and I played it at launch when I got it in the event and it was even more broken then and it than it was now. It was almost so, impenetrable by almost everything it saw. So it was mind bogglingly boring to play. So I just decided that I'd play it until I die for the first time. I think I played six or seven games, then ended up, then got bombed. So now I'm like 43 and one permanently in it. Yeah, like, and because it was that boring, I just have no interest in ever touching it again. And because the stats are funny. Another good excuse to never touch it again. There it is. Yeah, seven games, one death, 43 kills. The only heavy tank I like playing uh, is the Tiger. And that's just because it has enough mobility and it has the funny round. Well, flying is also, like, you need a mouse and keyboard. It doesn't matter if you're on console, but you have to have a mouse and keyboard to actually fly effectively. A controller just doesn't have the required inputs. Okay. Like, the accessible keys on a keyboard almost run out for all the controls you need. are fine they're just slow and I don't like having to rely on armor because <laughs> relying on surviving getting hit just is the, not my style the base respawned instantly oh nice I mean, like, more it, often it than moved, not I just get instantly it respawned yeah. instantly <laughs> it's like fuck you you don't have enough rockets for all of us oh okay See your rocket salvo key is the same as your radar. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's R for rocket. <laughs> R goes. Rrr. Oh yeah, I I watched Dune two finally. Speaking of movies, I watched Dune two finally and. Did you, uh, get the popcorn bucket? Uh, we don't have that in Finland. We're a... Okay. We're a no funny is allowed country. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but after that, I... Read, read the... One of the later books. And... To, just because I had a memory, like, I've, I, I've read them way back. But I was bored one night, so I went through one of them, like the later ones. I think, I can't even remember which one, like the fourth one. If 
spoilers for anyone who does, hasn't read about the books, but they essentially, the first two are just written on shrooms. The third two, third onwards, they're written on like turbo crack shrooms. And yeah, that. I don't know how that's uh, spoilers, but yeah. Yeah, no, but the spoilers are because the one that I read, because I can't remember which one it was. And I, I read like a condensed version out of it, like a one step above Cliff Notes. Uh, but essentially, it's the one where the main characters, one of the main characters, the main character has kids, I think twins, and one of them become turns themselves into a worm god who becomes the new emperor, who then rules the entire entirety of the world by being a worm and having god powers because of it. Uh-huh. Which, you know, makes total sense. Also, um, you can see about rocketing bases. Um, yeah. I killed one aircraft with my gun, blew up three bases, and got almost 20,000 RP without a talisman. At 130,000 SL on just normal aircraft. Like, there's a reason why people do this shit. Ah, it is the guy who goes neon. Hello, hello. You have an invite. Also, hello. Where's my... Where's the alpha jet? There it is. Uh, what are you flying? 8-7. Disgusting. Oh, yeah. I was about to say, now, easy, easy talisman on the alpha jet to speed up the grind, but I forgot you have the funnies on it. You have that lol mod modules done. Yeah, somehow, mysteriously. Mysteriously. I will pass on 8 7. <laughs> what do you mean? It's the greatest BR ever concocted. Do you not have, like, the TAM? Wait, me? Oh. No, the oh. Zoom. I have, like, Germany to, like, 8 0. Uh, okay, Probably so have so the TAM, I just don't have a board. The TAM is actually the, quite good. Only let down by front engine and slightly too not in like the seven degrees isn't enough. It does have a lot of empty space in the back though, so you can uh, you can do some stuff. Wait, which ones is she using? Like the French two fifties are the better ones. I don't know if what she's I... using the five hundred pounders. They're almost identical, but the two fifties oh, yeah. are sl slightly better. You know, it wouldn't surprise me if the like the 250s are bugged and the 500s were better. I wouldn't be surprised either. Yeah, but... I like how I just hit him and I just fucking threw his ass because this thing has so. <laughs> what's the what's your torque? Yes. Okay. Who could have thought that a Leopard 2 hull without a turret goes kind of fucking fast? And the that light and... 100 yeah. horsepower. Wasn't this a, uh... I thought this was a, a KPZ hull that they threw a turbo jacked engine in. What is it called? The VT-12? I'm, like, I'm like 75% sure it's a Leo 2 hull. And they stripped all the armor out, of course. Uh, yeah, there's a KX Mato free coming from there. It's like a Leo, it's like one of the prototype Leo 2 hulls. It's not even like an actual okay. Leo 2, 2 hull. I set him on fire. Okay. So he shouldn't have a front fuel tank, but you know. I'm gonna go from the left. He was just sitting there, he? don't know if he moved. Oh, a completely silent 435. 
going to be from their their side on the mark. You know what game? Fuck you, I'm spawning the shit box. Uh, but yeah, from myth from what we talked about earlier, the baseline Kurasir, so like the AMX 13, totally not AMX 13 uh, that Austria made with the 105. Uh, the base version oh my God. stabilized. Are you fucking serious? Like it's the A3 version that's stabilized. Sick, I can bring Napalm. I don't have. I just have to drop the drop tanks, I guess. There's not a loadout that doesn't have drop tanks on it. Yeah, cool. I am now stuck because. Okay, whatever. I wish I could just bring like a gun pod with more, like three gun pods with this. Oh thing. yeah, three beat Mausers. <laughs> I'll just bring like, let me put a Mauser on every pylon. <laughs> twin, twin mounted by uh, Mausers for all, all of the mounts. There is a jet with the oh, with the is. Peles. It's like behind this. Dealing with this air? Oh, it's a prop, whatever. Oh, yep. Yeah. Okay, cool. Uh, remember when I talked about how XMKPZs are like immortal currently? Yeah. Yeah, shot that in the front plate with a dart and it just did nothing. But this dude sure does love sitting still. Oh, good. A Chinese dude and a WZ. What a surprise. Is that enemy? No, that's friendly. I love how the names, for whatever reason, no longer render in as, like, actually visible. Oh, and our whole team's gone. That's not good. Oh look, it's the same guy coming back, sitting on the same corner. Wow, how'd that happen? <laughs> Loader engine transmission, that's not great. But thankfully he's a fucking bot, so, you know. There's a IT one with limited crew and a very mad fox. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that I hoped wouldn't see me and then his turret teleported 45 degrees and I was dead. Okay. 
I mean, I would have died either that. way because I was bouncing up and down. WZ is on the right hand side. That will definitely not end poorly. Cool, we have a 109 as well. So, a F4 with gun parts. Hell yeah. But I think, like, they confirmed that they're making Dune Free, which, if they want to cash out on it, they'll just modify the storylines somewhat, and they can easily make two to three more from the existing material that isn't completely made on crack. Like, it's still made on shrooms, but it's not, like, turbo bad. Uh, I can never really get into it fantasy series and stuff because there's a lot of just dumb shit in them oh what was designed to be a trilogy of movies uh the, the first two were made from the first book so it was up in the air if they'd make more okay i see that wz is there Dropped on it. Oh, there's a Shilka as well. Chinaman's dead. Drop on the Shilka or... Oh, you don't have armor, sorry. Uh, the IL is pulling for you. I dropped on the Shilka. I'm gonna get myself killed by the gunners of the IL-28. Die. Another WZ shooting at me. Yeah, it's the backup. Guaranteed. Yeah, I'm also getting shot at by a BMP or something. Yeah, I'll, the WZ should be dead. And he hits me, of course, at the last second. Oh, yeah. Why wouldn't he? So fuck off, dude. Can choke any other spawn? <laughs> oh, yeah, there. Oh, and spawn proud, because why not? Yeah, and that yeah, first shot. That's about the card I expected from that guy. Uh, Zoom's not playing this, he doesn't have the uh, vehicles. He's playing the TAM light, 251. Tam, but great because the Tam is good. Like I even really like the Tam 2C. Five thousand more, and then I don't have to play the term and spur spawn anymore. Then we have completed the Destroyer 45. Hmm. Our washing machine sounds like it's gonna come through my office wall. It's a nine, no wait, eight, nine, seven match, and we have a Tiger 2 first spot. 
and two first spawn helis. And a Panzer Free B. Who is queued with the Tiger and an L44. Yeah, so I'm guessing, yeah, they just don't know how the game works. And It'll be like yesterday when that guy uh, decided to um, try and defend his spawning the Type 93 first spawn. Because uh, I need to not be a sweat and I shouldn't dictate how he plays the game when I uh, tried to explain that um, him doing that fucks the game up for the rest of the team. And he's like, well, let them. he never responded. He, he never acknowledged that point. They never do. It's always the white. Why are you mad? Just stop tryharding. People can have fun. And like, yeah, so people should be allowed to have fun at the expense of ruining the fun of others. Okay, so. Oh yeah, that's the one with the RA. I'm fucking stupid, but there's two of them there. One's a grid, one's an A, uh, 55 AM. The other one's the Type IR-69. Uh, that might be an AMB. It's an AMB, yeah. He's like, the Chinese one pushed forwards, and that guy's still staring at me because he likes me. He's now turning towards... Uh, I can't see him, he's pushing towards you, just uh, on the Chinese one's corpse. Are you fucking kidding me? Ah, yeah, the breach takes no damage shot. Like, how am I supposed to have play the game and have that happen and ever say to someone, this game is good? That happens and it's automatically just like, the game is fucking dog shit. Yeah. That was a perfect shot. I did everything right in that situation. I shot first. I shot where I should have. 300 pen dart, just fucking gone. I did absolutely everything right in that situation, and I just get to lose. Uh, AMX DCA on that mark. No more AMX DCA. T55 next to him. Shulka and uh, AMD. Yeah. Er, oh, it was a Leo Marksman. There's another one shooting at me. Yeah, I, the AMD is looking at me, so I have to do some stuff. Because this versus an AMD from the front, not optimal. Yeah. Oh, there's a Veek as well. I, I have to just loiter. I, I have yeah, to get rid you're, of this AMD. You're good. You're good. Like... Ignore my marks. Yeah. Did you get rid of the AMD or is he still there? No, 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 he's there. Uh, he, there's no pre uh, there's two of them and there's no pressure from our team, so you know. I got the other one. Thank you. Yep. Oh wow, communication equals <laughs> enemies die. Who could have thought? Uh, that's a T-10 that I shot in the side of the turret with heat, but ricocheted because XD. I'm getting energy back. Yeah, yeah. Oh, JK, fine. I'm getting the shit shot out of me by someone. <laughs> just Shilka. I just started hearing the sound. Yeah, I didn't hear any tracer. Like, I didn't hear any shots or anything. Like, I heard him shooting, but I didn't realize it was uh, coming at me because there was no indication that it was, so... Yeah, that definitely hasn't happened to us today before. Whatever. Def 
the T10 definitely won't shoot me in the back if I just push their spawn to kill the Shilika, right? I don't care, where's the Shilka sitting at? I found you. I'm going to fucking die. <laughs> JK. Oh, he shot me with the 122. T killed one of my crew, turned the gunner red. But then he one shot me with the 14 5. Hmm. The fact that it's on a separate spawn pool from the G91 is so nice. Oh yeah, it's, it's good. But yeah, I got rid of Mr. Shilka with my totally KD saving strategy of holding W into spawn because I just want to get rid of the Shilka. Yeah. We like, honestly, I, that shot on the 55, I just, I don't understand how a dev could ever see that happen and think that is fine I'm proud of what I made yeah uh, they're probably snorting like dry iced vodka and just looking at their bank accounts go up JK, my bomb did nothing. Oh no, he got killed. Okay, I, I was about to make some comments. There's a plane, but it's slow and low. So I'm gonna do another pass. Yeah. Some, there's another plane which is not slow and low. <laughs> there's slow and low and medium and fast. Nice. Damage from video game. That was right next to him. He took no damage. We love bomb glitch. It's our favorite. Oh, that's AA. No, no, it's ours. I'll take the head on. I don't care. Oh, okay. Oh, I hit him and did nothing because XD. It's an F48. Flying towards you behind me. Behind me. Okay, I've hit him three times now. He's on fire at least. Game, give me the severe damage before the match ends. Okay, there we go. I wish they would add in a kinetic effect to projectiles, like missiles and bombs. Yeah, friendly Ozelot shot me because ha ha ha. There we go. The destroyer has been unlocked. It's not letting me close the window because the zester without buying the zester because. I it's it was the I have everything else in the tree. So it's now it's saying if you close the research window will be invested in Zestura forty five. I do, just, 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 let me out, you fucking I'll be right back while you uh <laughs> handle that. Internal character error. I'm stuck in this window. <laughs> okay, so I need to Okay, uh, Alt F4. <laughs> this game has no flaws. It is perfect.
works. Yeah, so the solution was Alt F4. Yeah, that always fixes it. Uh, well, not so... always, but... <laughs> so you're saying uh, VT1, 2 into C3, 4 and hope for the best. Or Tam, Tam. I that was works. thinking about it, but the VT on slopes is uh Yeah, that that, that that's also what hindered my excitement, bro. I'll do it too. Yeah, maybe not. You remember the S tank when it was first added and it was like insane always on all terrain, it was good. Yeah, then they nerfed traction and permanently broke the ball of call aim. Like, the S-Tank was actually legitimately playable when it was new, and then they're like, wow, I don't think so. This, like, super iconic tank, and it's just weird and good and fun, the and it, one, like, one thing Swedish tank designers are known for. No, nah, we're gonna fuck that up. Having fun, not in our game. It wasn't even, like, OP or anything, it was just, it was just playable. Yeah. No. Like, it was good. Like, it was positionally great, but overall just good. Like, it was a fun alternate gameplay. The game style. Alright, I just ricocheted off that BMP. Alright, great, great, good. I'd love to hear that. Uh, that's a... Why is this guy... What? Oh, he launched the thing. I just non pandaya I'm gonna freak out, dude. Okay, do not have enough gun depression for this. Oh, sorry. No, that wasn't you. Oh my god, man! I fucking died because this game is dog shit. How did I fucking non pan a fucking Markava? BMP2 just, or BMP, yeah, BMP2 just YOLO'd over that hill, and uh, the two dudes behind me just stared at him. Well, it's okay. I did nothing and got scouts, so uh, I got the Alpha Jet. Alright, I've got the rockets only Alpha Jet. Dude. So I'm testing this out until I get the good loadout. They definitely don't need to change how spawn points are allocated for this. This is fine. Oh, yeah. Yeah, scout, the scouting should just be significant. Like, the scouting removing or making spawning cheap, they should increase the reward for scouting and remove the scouting making planes cheaper. It should only be like 5%, maybe. Yeah, like, if, if that. They should just make it 5% non-diminishing. Definitely won't do anything funny with rockets. These will totally work. What are you going? Oh, yeah. Okay. Okay, okay so you, you bitch, stop them. <laughs> oh god, are they, you, you dumbass is really gonna go touch him? There's a heli below me. Oh, they announced themselves to the free kill. Then, yeah. So expect some, you know, yeah, retribution. Prop on me. Oh. Uh, he's not on you. He's just one. Yeah. He just. just hey, look, got there's really AA. close to me, and then there's an, a heli here somewhere. AA shooting at you. Yeah. There's two Yenisei's. Oh, oh uh, there's an S tank spawn camping them. Hilarious. Yeah, so they're MI4 AFK hovering at a incident. Oh, there's a jet. That's not good. Yeah, we talk shit about Hall A. <laughs> S tank goes and spawn camps. I mean, he's spawn camping AA. Yeah, that jet wants your ass. Yeah, I've noticed. 
It's a F eighty four F, so I should be yep. He had a severe uh, F eighty four F momento. There's a Chinese A. Oh, another Yenisei. Okay. Yenisei here. Yeah. He hit me with 50 cal, so I am slightly hurt. I'll fire a burst at him. I mean, you can just like lightly caress his face and he's just gonna explode. There's another A on you. Oh, ow. So, yeah, there were zero tracers for that. <laughs> Spawn protection, spawn protection, but dead. <laughs> mm. uh, we here at Shitstream are big Mauser fans. This gun is super obnoxious. Like, oh, yeah, it, it's, it's so good. Like, we need to not talk too much good things about it because they'll nerf it and you know it. Yeah, this is another DCA shooting him. It's the F eighty four F. That's like turbo mad. Uh, what zoom? Is that the twenty seven mil gun? Yeah. The Griffin gun. Yeah, but this doesn't have the Pele, so it's slightly less obnoxious. But it still has, you know, pain. So that dipshit has... is like right there. All right. Time for some desync. Let's go. It's not enemy shit. Low. He's firing, you see him? He's to the right of the explosion marks. Yeah, okay. Yeah. The... I can't see the jet. The jet's my heading, about a kilometer and a half in front of me, turning to the left. Yeah, like, I. The, now I see him. Like, because I knew where he was, he just wasn't there. It's a sky. <laughs> then he. Probably. And he turned, and the contra contrails forced him to render in. Wow, that's really cool, man. I'm I, I'm glad I hit that sick shot, and the game's like, no. <laughs> nah. -uh. It's an A4. Yeah. Oh yeah, you did say Skyhawk, not Seahawk. Okay, 50 cals, 50 cal. Do I review my viewer stats? I mean, I can. Be there. Okay, but so. it's almost always like very average, like what what you would expect from legitimately average stats. Uh, this I think it's a one six two Hobbit, like there. All right. Like I give people shit about stats, but I understand what the average stats actually truly are. Apparently the spawn protection has ended, right? Yep. What do you mean? Everybody has to have played the game for extended periods of time for at least 10 years playing all aspects of the game. Yeah. I mean, I do expect you to do like decent the higher or the more time you have, but that's just... Oh yeah, just... like there, there, there should be a increase in understanding and skill the more you've played. You should just be banned if your win rate is below 40%. <laughs> that is not not true. Really splitting like lobbies with other 40% win rate players? How are you guys going to play, like, high-ish tier for? I mean, if you want to play something lower, like, don't, don't mind. This is just... 
I've just been failing the Alpha Jets. Of course, wanted to spade the Alpha Jets because I don't have really <laughs> anything else to grind besides US 10 free. Playing by myself is me depression. <laughs> Six O Italy, let's go, Tigers. Yeah, sure. Uh, 6-0, oh, not 8-7. Oh. Yeah, I'm definitely listening. I definitely <laughs> didn't have really loud <laughs> stuff playing in the background. It's, it's fine. You're always listening. What the hell? Someone posted a picture of their Halo 2 Collector's Edition metal case, and it's just, like all rusted out. I have it sitting on the shelf behind me, and it's, like, pristine. What? Why? You see, when you store it in a saltwater aquarium, it like, doesn't do well. <laughs> do they just spit on it every day? Like, what the fuck? No, I'm not playing that on this map. I'm doing the funnies. World War One tank uniform, Hellcat. Rather, World War One race car driver uniform. <laughs> My name is Luigi. I drive the F1. It's the season of 1922. Definitely no cancel culture tomes there. <laughs> Not my realistic tiger camo. <laughs> you put the marks on it. It's blue. I love windmills. Oh, do you have the esports camo? Yeah. Oh, I don't see it. You need to see my SDA3 camo. <laughs> Oh, that almost thing. fucked oh. my radiator. Well, I didn't touch that, but I'm glad that it stopped me. Scout this? Like, scout under the turret? I, I can't. <laughs> I hear, like, a baby rage <laughs> tantrum behind me. 20 mil pinging off. I broke the gun by shooting the, uh... See that? Yeah. Oh, what the fuck? I, I blindly there? drove past. No, wait, what? Oh, it's like on this building. Oh, yeah, I, I thought you're on B because I saw my own scouting of the fucking train turret. <laughs> He's on B. Yeah, I scouted him. There's a second one as well. So I'm doing some high IQ gameplay right here. Oh, I'm. I like had a permanent aneurysm from that misidentification. <laughs> that broke my brain. Very high IQ gameplay. The W meets R3. The highest of IQ. Look at how OP. Am oh, I playing yeah, with people? Six, I think seven. Yeah, you can tear them. No, we're 
AI programs. Right, right. Finland right. isn't real. And neither is New Zealand. Not even there right now. Exactly. How could you be somewhere that's not real? Checkmate. Exactly. <laughs> oh shit! Um, that is an IS-2. I see. I'm just lost in the trenches. Because, like, I still haven't recovered from that. Thinking a T-34 drove past me. Incident. Yeah, so he's too low for me, so you're a long shoot. Uh, the tree just hit the ground. Oh god. Where? Can I hit the cupola from here? I sure. can, but it does nothing. I've been shot in the side. Ow. And I scout bugged. Sure. There's a bulldog there. My scout oh. decided to not work. Ow. Oh, my kill. Load PZ tomorrow. Don't worry, I have enough small points for my TU2 already. I can be there. Oh, yeah, now I remember why I don't play these tiers at the moment. That bomb glitch broke me yesterday. There's someone between. Up, up, up! There's a bomb glitch? Bombs will randomly not kill on direct hits and stuff. Or, like, right next to someone, it just won't kill. And then there's times where bombs will kill when they really shouldn't. It, like, bombs are just bugged. There is someone in front of us. You hear that, right? Yeah, like behind this. Also, over there, PT-76 scouted. So you're making noise before I kill this jo Oh, you can't shoot through that. That's, yeah. <laughs> okay! <laughs> <laughs> That's not funny, but I mean, yeah. Why? Why would I be able to shoot through a chain link fence? I know exactly what you tried to shoot through too, which is why yeah. it's funny. <laughs> like, uh... oh, this map. That is a T-29, Patricia. Sure. Yeah, I have no, uh... Yeah, I have some I... ouchies for him. I missed. It's, I'm guessing it's the one Chevron. I missed again. Well, oh, shit. Wargamer Hungary is about to experience Hungarian technology at its finest. Nope, never mind. He went into the ground, so I have no idea where that bomb is going. It's one I fresh. Okay. Okay. Well, that's not very fresh. Yeah, not quite. We're we're doing a thing. So there's a jumbo who is pressing W very hard at me. Okay, so I shot like a bot and just, then just got hit. So, I mean, I got what I deserved, but I still hit him enough to the point where he should have taken damage, but he didn't. Now I'm being shot at, which is not nice. Oh, shit! Yeah, I'm fucking dead. 
His 50s do a lot more damage than my 50 and 20. Did you like die? Oh, it's a bear cat. Not a bear, so. I wish my bear cat tanked that many rounds sitting on the ass of a TU2 and being hit by it const constantly. There was an air flying towards you guys from the hill, by the way. That's it. He's in an AM1 now. Oh, this is like the 1.0 shitty thing. The bomber. Yeah, so I'm kind of fucking mad about that. <laughs> He could not aim to save his life, and his engine and pilot just tanked all of the Dushka 20 and 20 mils. No. Then, then he hit me once and my winning wing exploded. No, wait, he hit me once, my engine exploded, and then for the second time my wing exploded. So two times. Wow. Here's going after the Sakin. Yeah, it's the AM1. It's yeah, Mr. Bearcat. Yeah. He's going to have a momentum. Dude, I'm not taking it head on with an AM1 when I'm the one in line. Like, what the fuck are you smoking? Pussy. Just take every oh. head on. Well, Where's your mock went away? Uh, Zoom stole my head on. The mage. Oh, I took my head on. You had your chance. Yeah, but I was called a pussy for it, so I had you know, I would have had to take the second one as a new air. Might be the same guy again. I see a truck. I see a duster. So yeah. Oh that's a very scary truck. It's a frog though. It's gonna be five hundred. There's a Z as well. Yeah. yeah. It's an ace bomb, I think. Yeah, it's like... I have, uh, pitched up into the air. What's on a... Okay. Yeah, that's the ZD. Uh, Duster and ace bomb is very accurate. Oh, uh, yeah, it's Mr. Bearcat, man. It's ace bomb. Gonna... Yeah, it's ace bomb. Somehow getting near me, I can uh, miss all my shots. Yeah, there's a duster in the way going to you. So. Yeah. Okay. So can these guys are like, very bad. <laughs> yeah, can you live for like 30 seconds. I'm fine. Like, this guy is a Corsair who can't play. So, just ditching my bomb. My remaining 50 because he's not leaving his ordnance. I see. Stole my severe damage. Toxic person. That was my kill, you bitch. I survived the one we two and you stole my second one. Fucker. And you counted me. That's just. Uh, just gonna drop 1000 on him. Cause... I don't know anything to set up on this. If you guys could get rid of this Sherman, that would be just phenomenal. Yeah, so bombs, those are like long. Duster's dead. Oh, there's two of them. Oh, one here. Yeah, that's the original Duster. Uh, which Sherman? Like on top of me. This one? Yes. I hear air and I can't see. Which usually means I'm about to become a fucking girl in the sky. Yep! Oh no, it's another terrible dust, uh, Corsair. We're good. He's bombing! 
think no. Oh, I got hit by one shrapnel uh, from like a hundred meters away. I, I got him. Fire went out, but I don't have the fuel anymore. Insane MG151 though. Yeah, so cheers. One of you needs to shoot me down. That guy does not deserve a kill from me. Like, I saw him drop his 1000s. I pulled up, I was over a like, I was 250 meters out, into it, and a single piece of crap shrapnel hit me and set me on fire. Which burned down all my fuel. Okay, well, I hit you, but yeah. Yeah, well, now he's giving the kill to the whatever that guy, China AA, is. But this is to totally. German AA. Okay. Dude, I just need to make a video on this. I should have recorded this game. Like, yo, the R3's OP is shit! I got the nuke! Well, I'm 34 points off the nuke. Yeah. What the fucking... Whatchamacallit, it's... The... HE chain so that the shrapnels fly like a billion miles away and send you a fire. Those have sure have been fun. That bot had like a two second fuse on him with his 1,000 pounders, so I, instead of being like 100 meters altitude and off, off target, so which should have been enough to dodge on its own, I was like 250 meters up and got hit by a single piece of shrapnel, perma fired all my fuel. Alright, you're a jet. That's ours, we have a 262. Alright, so the guy who uh, was uh, complaining that uh, I'm a furry is 1 in 3 and left the game. Yep. Very, uh. <laughs> very good. Alright, level 29. Good. Alright, Giga Hyper Ultra Negative. Good. He's 14 and 2 on the Pershing with a 71% win rate. He's a good player. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. 2 and 14. That died. Yeah, I said that backwards. He's 2 and 14 in the Pershing with a 71% win rate. Yep. And probably one of the loudest bitchers on Reddit about how Cassie's OP and broken would be my guess. Just not as good as him. Stop hating. <laughs> true, true. I retract my statement and uh, I will make an apology video explaining how I've learned from my mistakes and I will pro I promise to do better in the future. Thank you. Oh yeah, Shiz, did you watch, uh, watch the video I sent? The enlisted one. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, I haven't kept up at all with Enlisted, and that, like, holy fuck. I mean, it's not surprising. Like, there's no reason oh, for it absolute... to be on Steam. Like, there's no reason for them to put it on Steam. I mean, the reason they were putting it on Steam is because they have no players. So they were trying to get more players. And then they did that. So You know what they could do to get more <laughs> players? It's really, really simple. They could put the old movement back in the game. It was actually a good shooter. Like, Enlisted, when it was brand new, was actually a good shooter. They just needed to fix a little, like, some balance problems. Oh, but yeah. But besides that, it was actually a good game. Like, the monetization in it has always been garbage. Like, you, there's nothing in the game that is worth the money besides premium. 
the premium was sort of worth it. Well, the bar squad when it was brand new was. Uh, oh yeah. Well, oh yeah. Yeah, I don't mean, but you you get what I mean. Like in general, yeah, the monetization yeah. on it has, has been like god awful from the get go. But the point the guy made was of Gaijin treating it as in if if it were War Thunder was so good. Like that just reveals Gaijin's mindset to such a broad degree. They don't understand what kind of a monopoly of a niche market they have with War Thunder, which is why the players put up with a lot of the shit they do. Yeah. Whereas enlisted, enlisted is like a generic shooter. shitty shooter that's not even that good. Like it's all right if you have a full squad to play with, but yeah. it's pretty dog shit otherwise. And the progression is abysmal. It's better now. Well, the progression originally was actually insanely easy. Oh yeah, but then the, because whenever the like compression was bad, power creep was bad, and all the new levels on top of the old levels were of the max level uh, requirement. They never decompressed the requirements, which was the big thing. Yeah, I'm just gonna say you could grind out the entire level in one game if you were gaming hard. You know, really, really hard. But you're at me. I see a KV-220. I don't wanna be here. Like, Enlisted actually had potential to be, like, unironically a battlefield killer. Oh yeah. Initially, definitely. Ah, it's I'm so mad. This fucking Super Sherman bot has soaked up so many hits that it shouldn't have. I actually had better luck on Normandy as allies. But we also had the jumbo in like one day, so. Yeah. We were, uh. Hitting them with the dick twist on, like, day two with the Jumbo. <laughs> Hello, A20 Jumbo. Okay, game over. Bye. Yep, pretty much. <laughs> oh, that's a super perfect fight. Every, every... That's enemy. That is the super purging. Why is it coming after me? Zoom, you've cursed me. It's in between these balls. No, it's chasing me. <laughs> oh. Okay. He didn't know about the strat of, you know, pressing W instead of sitting here. still. Ah, oh, I missed. I got his loader. Ooh, run around the corner! Okay. <laughs> you almost got me killed. He was turning to hit you, then he suddenly saw me, so he pressed the fire key. But his gun was pointing too low, so he hit the dirt. Good. Red team. I'm hold up. This air is scary sound. Shut the off. Artillery bad. Artillery not good. Where's the air even at? I don't see it. It might be ours. No. I have one. Oh, there's a bulldog. What am I fucking... Right. What? The, God damn it! I see 122 bats. Oh, that's not good. Okay. This game is just been tragic. Super Sherman is down three the, the entire turret crew. Then there's a 2S3 and a IS, ISU and the T3485 on scouts. Target destroyed. Now they finally figured out that they can also shoot. Yeah, 
still the Super Sherman. That has to behind the hill. Oh yeah, if you had a bad computer and you're getting 12 FPS unless it's like unplayable. But... I just quit gaming if my computer was that bad. Uh, there's a like row of them coming out of spawn. I'm gonna I go out on a limb and say that's like more of them. Oh, I couldn't game. Like, I, there's no way I would do like, literally anything else. I'm so used to having the stuff that. I just, I can't play on bad hardware, it's like actually hard, it's difficult to do. There's two AAs in spawn. It's a jumbo. And an IS here. I'm going to kill the AAs, give me like 10 seconds. Yeah. Nah, I'm like gonna come be fine with them. That's, that's something not AA, and then there's the two BTRs. I see the behind me. The progress shit's jammed and he's stuck there. Yeah, there's two on that forward bomb mark. There. One's behind him, it's a challenger. Question mark. This tiger just drove past the chat and just killed me. Oh, I have the nuke. Oopsie. Gonna spawn in there. Yeah. Put that 15,000 SL. Yeah, I was about to say, totally gonna spawn that in instead of farming more RP for my TU2. Definitely gonna do that. Oh my god, he's in spawn, bro. What is? The M16. That's a heavy. That's a KV2. Oh, it's a KV2. Oh, cool. Uh, the fame recognition school. Oh, God. Um, There's a M16. Yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah. Or a TCM. That's oh, an M16. Ooh! Uh, Sarah's Japanese. No. <laughs> Turn. Oh, it's. Bring the, him to me. It's like the 1.0 B5M2. Oh, the 800 kilogram delivery machine is totally not better to use the 60s. I've gone! I've got yeah, now I do this, and then I do this for the memes. <laughs> <laughs> You're KD! <laughs> Oh, you slammed it to you too. Too. as well. <laughs> but I put it in a straight line. Yeah. Whatever shall I do? Oh, my KD. Uh, bet you've never crashed two aircraft that fast together. <laughs> I mean, yeah, if you don't have a problem with it, but I'm saying that I'm so used to the hardware I'm using now, if I had to try and play on 12 FPS on ultra low, I, I, there's no way. Absolutely no way. I don't even have a monitor that's below 1440p. I get nope. Okay. D47 stock, not good. Like, my air quotes backup monitor is just like two 4K monitors in the other room. They're like shit, but they're still 4K monitors. I'm kind of on the verge of just buying a talisman for the Italian P47 so that the stock grind is not that slow. Because 
spending a hundred GE for a tier whatever shit. Just talisman at the forty seven is yeah. fine. Because that's what I'm gonna be using instead of the RE two thousand five. I'm I'm sick and tired of that thing by this at this point. Been bricked too hard. I'll become that turbo shitter in the P forty seven. Oh yeah, I mean that's the thing. That's like, um, once you use two monitors, you can never go back to one. Once you use an SSD, you can never go back to an HH or HDD. Once you've used a uh, M.2, you can never go back to SSDs as your boot drive. Okay, so going through C, hoping for the best? Question mark. I am Yoloing B in the R three. I see. So you're being a toxic fucker. Cruise position. Ready up. Ready. Don't worry, we've got a movement that's gonna keep you company. I mean, hell, even going hard drives, like if you were using a Western Digital Green and you went to a Western Digital Black, you would never ever be able to go back. You'd never be able to use a green drive again. That's actually like speaking of KDs, like that's something that I've realized that I don't get why people care about KDs that much. Like if I'm in a vehicle where I'm not having fun in a match, like there's nothing happening and I know that it's gonna take either a lot of time for me to get somewhere where something's gonna happen, or there's just been bullshit, I'll just J out and leave and go to the next match. Like, I don't care. I think the Strela is a good example of that. I've spawned it probably like seven times, and I think I've been killed once, and I've just jaded out the rest. Because there haven't been air up, and I'm not sitting in a fucking man pads only vehicle for waiting for someone to come. Wait, shut up, shut up. I guess it was just odd, like, weird audio. Yeah. I swore I heard an engine. And, uh... I just watched YouTube. I found! Uh, I'm not going towards C, Zooms. I'm just cutting in towards B. So you're pseudo alone there. Um, I mean, yeah, if you don't know, like, that's what I'm saying. If your hardware works for you and you don't know any better, it's not a problem. But as soon as you use good hardware for an extended period of time, it, like, breaks you. Yeah, then you start to notice stuff that you never thought about before. It's the same thing with eating good food. If you like, if you eat just like flank steak 24/7, but then for whatever reason someone gives you a week's worth of filet mignon, you'll like the flank steak will be disgusting forever, unless you cook it in a specific way. Oh, there's a bulldog. Well, that's kind of what I was wondering, but I found that guy. I'm sure Someone he was happy that was I, I was here. <laughs> oh, there'll be. That has my name written all over it. It's not so much that flank steak has too little flavor, it's a different flavor. Like Every cut of meat tastes very different to me. Oh, he's dead now. I, I could not for the life of me find the guy. Then suddenly I see a gun pointing out of a bush. I'm like, okay. <laughs> hey, not that one. Yeah. Hey, that was a perfect excuse for me to spawn an unarmed P47. Grind out the modifications. Have you also, after the last patch, have you noticed on some maps where when you spawn air, the map is like screen flickers and stutters? Very annoying. I hear a flying. Yeah, I'm diving in the first, guys. I see. Shit, he's ensuring I get no RP. I'm sad. He's fucking YOLOing me! What do you want me to do? <laughs> Die, hello. I mean, steal the kill, I don't give a shit. I like, no, 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 no. He's on fire and gonna die. That's your kill. 
But no, I don't care. Take the kill. Friend. It doesn't yeah, matter. Yep. See, that's what so you get. That, that's what you get. You should have taken the kill. No, but he was crashing. I'm not gonna go after an on-fire crashing guy and lose altitude because of it. Uh, what's the shot? Uh, Vatel. Where? I know Shiz doesn't give a fuck about me taking the kill. Like, if it was better for me to take the kill there, I would have done it. Imagine knowing how to aim this gun. That would be unheard of. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. You still have to take it out. Something else should be. Yeah, it's a German on the right. Over here. I have a loader transmission. That BTRZ hit me with his very first shell. Severe damage. What's the F2 machine from the on fire? Why? Oh my god. CD off the left. Oh. Yeah, that mark was... I didn't see him, I just heard it. That was some, like, giga hyper bait. Uh, it's whatever. You know, I don't actually like lamb. It's just not my thing. I... I've never it's like bland to me. Lamb and rabbit and just venison even. It's just, yeah. Oh yeah, that BTR player up. is BTR player is not good enough for me hitting for him to be hitting those shots. So he's either having the luckiest best game of his life or he's decided that he's had enough of being shit. I see. SU-6, for example, sh definitely wouldn't be a very, very, very easy kill right now if I had, you know, proxy. There's two more, and now there's two more aircraft. There's four air. Wow. That's, uh, horrifying. Yeah, actually, I'm just doing this. I see. And I'm doing this. Alright, we're good. Will you fly me? That fucking bitch. I better get in the destroyer. Kill you for no reason. I'm just, I'm just average Yeah. This thing used to be OP as hell. I don't know if you played back on that. Was like when this was now. No. I mean, 
The G55S was like hyper OP. It was so good. Oh, yeah. It was like a 90 something percent win rate. Or like a complete um, response here. Edge. I, have, I hit the A1H. He's still doing loop de loops here. It's the guy I've hit with a. 155 proxy, a bunch of 50s, and now with a few 20s as well. Oh, that's a skank. Uh. I'll drop the 1H. Yeah. Wait, he's still not dead. Severe. Oh, me and Zoom, me and Zoom are shooting the shit out of him. And he's just. Oh, dying. I'm dead. There's a one. There's a T44 122 there. Oh, this a right next to Crusader. 20 mil. Oh, I see. Right From next to our. Teammate, there's a IS something. It's a T44 and an IS T44 is here, IS is behind me. You? Shoot the Hellcat. Hellcat, Hellcat. Oh, there were two highest. Two, or that's. No, I said it's a T44 and an IS T. Yeah, there's a T. Yes, yeah, so there were T44s on both sides of you. Whatever, I'm leaving. Skank. I'm trying to kill these tanks. Um, is, is it a skank or is it Crusader? Oh, it is a skank. <sighs> How much of their Oops. team do they have left? Oh, I was just fucking with you. Okay. Oh, fuck, there's air on me. No, 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 like, I, I didn't even hear what you said. But yeah, I'm at the point where I'm just got, not gonna spawn into this map again. I don't remember the last time I've had any fun on this map. Oh, I hear another one. Yeah, I'm coaching up for you guys now. It's an I-185? Yeah, just fuck me. How's it to us once more, Cam? What are the fucking thermals on this thing? Why is this overheating? Why is there a jet? Every spawn of that was paid. There's a P8 found. Corsair's totally silent.
Yeah, if that map comes up today anymore, I'm just leaving. Like you guys can play, but I'm not dead. So. I only play. Like, yeah, I don't want to see it high tier if I'm in mid tier. I just YOLO B in whatever my fastest vehicle possible is. On the tiger, the tiger Tigris never, never sucks. Always have a good time in it, even when I'm tilted to trust. Positions. Definitely don't overact and get myself pinned by a short 75. That thing you posted, Runner, um... I don't know, I wouldn't be too worried about that. Completely off me. Just turned around for no reason. Like, that's gotta be super easy to detect. It's like, you're somewhere you're not supposed to. The server-side checks would easily be able to handle something like that. Is that the cannon you should tell them? No, it's someone flying. Like, four guys over there. Unsurprisingly. Uh, one guy on the left of this. This Guy pushing there. Not off the woods. Yeah. This that entire like this section should be blocked off completely. Oh, that's a 2S Bernie, uh, 2S Green. So I can't pen that AMX's turret with this gun. There's still at least one over here, but I can't. Yeah, wow. I hear one behind this. You run in a clean 61, huh, dude? Right. Uh, that is a. What the fuck is that? It's an IS2, I think? Uh, yeah, IS2 or KV 122. Let's see if. Yep, it works. <laughs> the thing about it, Blue, is that um, with how that shit works, it changes your point of view to being in the air. So you can fire an ATGM up, and then that thing, like, you'll be able to guide it down since your point of view is in the air down. So it'll just allow you to use ATGMs in a way that you shouldn't be able to, and it'll only work with stuff like the swing fire. Uh, low, 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 here, 2 us yeah. one Uh, two there, two there. What, what? Uh. Let's get out. M36 over there. I'm turning to check if they're trying to come home. Try right, we're about to be bombed, we're about to be bombed. Yeah. Well I shot the sh I severe damaged him, but he's still alive. Are you guys in? Yeah, I'll bring them. I don't even see him. Oh, cool. I put oh, minimum fuel there. to test out whether it works or not. Yeah, got 40 minutes of fuel. 
F60 set 18. I don't like videos of actual cheating. That's something that like, like don't post shit where people are actually selling hacks. I hate when people do that. You're literally just spreading the hacks. Even though the majority of people will, will be like, okay, what the fuck is that? There will be the people who say nothing, who go, holy shit, I want that. Yeah. I mean, I don't, I don't care. Like, I, I don't care if it, that's, that you want that to be as unknown as possible. Oh. I get on people's case about that on the CC Discord all the time. You don't want to repost hacks. It's like advertising. It's literally advertising shit that you don't want advertised. Drugs. Oh, I'm dead. AA fresh bond duster, I think. Yeah. Also, I wasted a thousand kilo bomb on what I thought was an enemy moving in the river, but it was the overhanging gondola that was just moving because I was flying closer. Very wise. Oh yeah, shit! There's two. Game. There's a uh, this guy here. Okay, but, like, that doesn't matter. Something like that, you don't need to post videos on that. Someone, it'll get caught. Uh, air coming in. I'm assuming she's got, has the air. Yeah, it's an IL-2. BTI. Should be dead. Okay. We love AA that hug e hugs each other. Yeah. Was ZD? Yeah. And there's another one as well. Yeah. Let's sit still and spray the 50 cal at two bombers. Um, always going for the guy who's not diving towards us, because that's the guy who just bombed us who's flying away. He needs to die. To be fair, I did not destroy Oh yeah, like, I, the dive I took, I should have died. Like, if they had two brain cells, I would have been dead. Because I had to fly in a straight line way too close to them. As far as I'm aware, the guy who was doing the Katusha like teleportation hack shit got banned instantly. Same with the G91 clips. Took me like an hour and a bit to get banned. Oh, there's a plane on me. That's not good. Oh. Well, the match is over, whatever. I should be researching the MI24D. That gets efficient research from these. Fucking 7,000 IQ right here. Yeah, the, hmm, what will I use as a helicopter for the Italians? An MI24D? Or a civilian helicopter that refuses to stay still. Hmm. This is gonna fucking suck. 
Doing pain in A or are we doing die in C? To battle! Button up! Ready. 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 See, that's optimism. That's not allowed. You still like not like right here? I don't think so. You might be able to. Yeah, you there's well you can go on the beach at least. I mean, funny. Blue, like, you can look at the fucking list of people who got banned. It's obviously working. It's just, like, there's always... So the thing with cheating and catching cheating is it's a cat and mouse thing. The anti-cheat team is always behind the people developing hacks. Always. Because the cheaters just need to find a hole in the system. Whereas the anti-cheat needs to protect from everything, which... And there's always a vulnerability in everything. There's no way to make something 100% secure. Yeah, that's like cybersecurity versus hackers. Like, hackers will always be ahead. Behind us. Fuck, it's... Yeah. Oh, wait. Yeah, on the beach. He shot through me hit, trying to hit you and still killed yeah. everything in me. But that's the thing that people who are cheating rely on is people getting discouraged. There's a ton of people who will cheat and get banned and not cheat anymore, or they'll just quit playing the game. And then there's the people who will cheat and cheat and cheat and cheat and cheat, no matter how many times they get banned. You just have to keep reporting them, catching them. It's just how it is. It's the same shit in Tarkov. And especially on free-to-play games, um, it, it's like the game is fucking free. It doesn't cost people anything. That's why games that are free always have an enormous problem with cheating, because there's no investment besides buying packs. Like, War Thunder used to be relatively... Like, cheating's always been a thing, but it's not been that prevalent, but mysteriously when a specific culture got deeply embedded into the global servers, the cheating went through the roof. Wow, I didn't kill him, holy shit. There's another super shaman right there. Okay, so the Hellcat can't get up this, like, railway thingy, driving head oh, on. Oh yeah, you have to go sideways, a lot yeah. of stuff gets stuck on it. Oh, there's a Rattel 90 up on the thingy. Okay. Reload. I see. But I shot the... I but, love the headbox headboxes in this game. That is what people who are cheating are banking on. They want people to get discouraged and not bank, like not report them. And just keep reporting them, but don't post like shit like that. Fucking shit in the CC Discord pisses me off too. People post videos of like, buying hacks. Just... It is not good to advertise that. Even if you're doing it for a very good reason, there's still no reason to do it. Just refrain.
the T-3485 is somewhere between me and A. It might be the scouted one. Oh my god, that's a frog. Yeah, it's definitely the scouted one. Oh, it's wise when it's been on me too. Two. And the Hornet. Wow, this is really cool. I'm in AA, but I'm terrible with this thing. So that dude shot like five of our teammates in the ass while he was scouted. <laughs> and they were all piling up on the same corner. It's a leopard one. Also, hello, Spidey. Been Wiseman. <laughs> yeah, it's the uh, 40 millimeter off the freshie of the high rate of fire one. I mean, my, oh my, my ordnance machine. What is he fucking doing there? God damn. That's the Hornet, right? And the Wiseman's is the one that's still doing loops. Yeah, Hornet should know. Yeah. Yeah, especially because the Hornet does not like flying on one engine. Mercury is high up in fuel as well, so it should burn. Yeah, there he goes. Stock, stock P47 versus Wiseman's. Here we go. I yeah. I can't see the fresh air. Where is it? There he is. Now he renders in cool, so I'm dead. It's a Saki. I mean, I agree. Aircraft should be more expensive to spawn in. But as long as it's not, there's no reason not to use it. Oh, there's a bird pair playing on me. That's that's great. What is that? Zoom? That's... I don't know. I'm just dead. Probably... I said zoom. Like... The... Whatever. Like okay. three planes on me. Shot him right. I... Charity. Huh. Okay. What's a T thirty four? was a backup. Yeah, that was a backup, David. Heavy 
tank on aim. Our 109 missed the 250 on it, you know, not great. Oh, we oh I see. Track. The fucking shit got posted. Mm -hmm. Holy fuck! that we were talking about, it affects all age units. What? What was that?! I'm gonna die. I know I broke this gun over. Dude, why is this not doing damage? Oh my god. Nope, I'm gonna hit this fuck. Nope, I managed to save it. Sack KV85 on C. And then a guy coming through the middle here. No, not that there. A super map. I need yeah, then there's the super purging on our side of the map. Going from A. The super purging should be dead. First, both fighters. They're gonna cap me. So it's from close. I just got shot in the back. It's probably this guy. These are both single yeah. engines. Front one's the like some BB one or some shit. It's like I got I got hit by huh. AA. So I... Oh, I put him into a flat spin immediately. Okay. If I got hit by 50 cals or AA. Yeah. It's a frog shit. Oh, yeah, I'm dead. Yeah. On the move, jumping. What's my gunner? have these AA guys sitting permanently in spawn and they are not doing anything. Well I mean Yeah. Oh. I see track. I see. Hmm. God, he dropped a fucking 250 on it, man. Yep. The stairs have more like a mirror hitch. Now, 30 seconds. There's an arrow above where the launcher is. fighter. The STRV 74. Uh, what's the big act break? Deek 
camping A unless there's a corpse that I can hide behind. Yeah. That was insane. Like, a literal god. That's driving crew for now because we can't risk staying out in the open. Okay, that Dantos' crew is orange and yellow. I'm um, driving to B. 200 F. It's B. Two known. Um, I don't know what the fuck it's Super Sherman is. Super Sherman's gotta be somewhere around there. Yeah, I hear it. No, no, it's. Yeah, okay. The Antos is somewhere around here. I lost him because I was trying to look at someone else. I tried to grab the Antos on my way. Oh, I see him. He's over here. Yeah. Uh, ping this or a team? Yeah, okay. Thank you. I see. I overdropped it. I don't even know why I dropped that. Well, I'm wasting his time. He's uh, just like driving around trying to avoid me. Fuck, this two on me, is it? Okay, that's not good. Get people behind me. We're gonna lose me here. I'm so sick of being shot on the move, man. Wanted to kill that so we don't risk A, but that might have been not great. Because they'll cap C before I get to B, unless this Oh, there was three doesn't. on C. Is that ours? Oh, uh, yeah, okay. Okay, I hit that guy a hey, shit time. Hey. Yeah, it's a BTR quad gun. Yeah, I should be able to. Do that to him. Uh, that Super Sherman spawn is going to spawn in a Wiseman's, but you're already close enough that it won't matter. I just got tapped by a single 50 cal and it lit me on fire. Allied. The fire went out instantly, but I'm out of fuel. I see, I'll be right back. The game's exploding. You guys can hear me, right? Yeah. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I also lost all audio because, haha. <laughs> Hell yeah, I can use three 250s on the P47. Those are definitely not susceptible to the HE glitch or bomb glitch.
Alright, I'm back. Oh, one more game, and I'll have the shulk. Oh, good. <laughs> and then I'll have the entire Italian ground tree done again. The Italian air tree is the only tree in the game that I still have stuff like actually missing. Because I'm missing the air superiority tornado and then the IL-28 and SU-22M. Uh, I'm missing... Uh, yeah, my air trees are pretty bad. Well, not like pretty, they're not the worst, but like, Israel, Sweden's done, France, I need some mirages, because I just... Oh, this... I, I, oh. There's, no pen, there's no pencil or phantom to do it. Yeah, there's no like easy mode grind. You actually have to play the game, and I hate that mirage. It gives me AIDS. It's better now that the Magic 2s don't suck, but... Yeah, it, like you and with that you technically if you take the sneb pods and a 2000 pound you can and you can still run your full air to air loadout as well and get a base but you're slow as shit and everybody's going for bases so you're just going do 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 yeah you uh, you have to loiter <laughs> for 5 minutes it's bad yeah uh i am the j7e so the china grind isn't that bad i just need to do it japan i have the ej so that's not bad Britain. Uh, for China, you just put a talisman on the Q5L and play 9-7 China with me. <laughs> I mean, I could, but I have the J7E RRB. I know. The funny PLs that go yeah. nyong. <laughs> the, they're not that much better as you launch it and it just teleports it, <laughs> mock Jesus into their fucking family soul. Because, you know, very... <laughs> goes back goes back in time and annihilates their grandparents in childhood. Yeah, yeah like, <laughs> the PL5B <laughs> is fucking crazy. It's so good. Because if you're like within a, a certain track, like if you're within a certain distance, you can't flare it. It will just kill you. Yeah, because it will it will hit you before the game recognizes there being a flare. I'm gonna do something stupid between B and C because I really don't like this map. Because I know playing B is the play, but the amount of times I get fucked there is too high. So now I just play the whole W center line and still get fucked, but usually have enough points for a play. I tried the Bulldog at 6 0 again. Oh, yeah. With the old turret traverse? The old, uh, And all the round. Oh, God. <laughs> Upper front plate king tigers! Yeah! Let's go! Next, it's balling that kills all everything in one shot. But it has more pen now! It's better! <laughs> I do have to say, it is nice to be able to just pen. Uh, just, uh, Yak Tigers in the face. <laughs> you, you win some, you lose some. That's a paladin going right with this barrel like as high as possible. Uh, they nerfed the turret traverse on the Bulldog. They made the shell F300 pen and raised it to 6-3. Paladin that's coming. There we go. Nice 50 cal. Yeah, as good as like the bulldog was for us, I like never had any issues with it. Random. Oh yeah, because they, people don't know how to play it. Yeah, I, 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 I was about to. Yeah, I was about to rage about my shell not being registered as for a KTH kill, but then I realized I got shot by a tiger I didn't see, and my barrel just ate it and turned just orange. So, I, I will take that trade of bullshit, because I should have died there. No. I'm not having fun anymore. Okay. 
Okay, so yeah, he got saved by volumetric because ha ha ha, I'm bad. What? Get Tiger right here! <sighs> I see, I see the Panthers side skirt volumetric still in full effect. Mr. Man's gonna already double kill. Yeah, I I do too every time. Whatever, I'm just crossing. I I don't. I'm not sitting here because that panther sits still staring at the angle for the whole game. Fuck that. Dude. Found your guy. Nice corner. Oh yeah, but the Hellcat is bad at 5-7. To be fair, I don't think I've heard anyone say that. I've heard it a concerning amount of times. I mean, I don't There's think it a... really needed to go up because it doesn't matter, but... Oh yeah. I've heard uh, A3 Sherman is bad at 5-7. The guy who killed me is called Logikanfi, which means Salmon Carp in Finnish. Okay. Hey, I've got three 250 pound bombs for my P47. We're beginning to gain. There definitely won't be any HE glitches here. Oh, so I just one shot his tail off? One five ones? I think this guy might be a bar. I do. Did I overdrop? Yeah, I overdropped. You can't accept failure on your part. You uh, have to comply. Oh yeah. Uh, HE glitch. What the fuck? Where's my kill? Like that? That I'm kind of mad about. I'm lighting him up, and I turn his gunner or I turn his commander yellow. Like fuck off. There's a progress shooting at me. Yeah, there's a Ostwind shooting at me. Uh, you killed the Ostwind, I killed the Praga? Praga's on reload. <laughs> okay. Ostwind will never be on reload. So I'm just waiting for the random hit that is bound to happen at some point. I have nothing. Yeah. The Praga reloaded so fast, man. He's in a B tier ZD now. Yeah, oh yeah, but to uh, oh, cool. to um counter the bullshit, like to counter the bulldog nerf, they added in the seventy six Sheridan, which is the bulldog on like every drug imaginable, like every upper imaginable. <laughs> and then to counter that, they added the fox. Yeah. <laughs> uh, there's a ZD. I think it was left spawn. I killed the Ostwin, but I'm out of my small bombs, so I'm going for more. Oh, actually, no. You're in the TU too. I'll come loiter for you. Get those good guys, it's actually quite good. Uh, wait, what now? Get the... I don't wanna play the game. Ah, okay. I just wanna give it to me. Yeah, just do what Koozie did, and give them, give your account to a guy who got banned for chanting. Hacking, so he can play, grind for you. Account sharing a CC account. Account sharing a CC account with a cheater. <laughs> As their server is down, yeah. Where's yeah, the VD? Yeah. <laughs> okay, Salmon Carp is killing our team. 
sound on car is something. Okay, there's a backup ZD, because why not? But now I'm actually no, what the fuck, I'm not gonna be back before the game ends. Ermaloiter. How? It wouldn't surprise me. People share accounts all the time, even though they specifically are told not to. Oh yeah, well, what I saw him say was that he was very, very burnt out, which, I mean, that I can absolutely believe, that didn't really want to play anymore, so... He gave the account for the guy to grind for him. Then he was talking about it on stream, so... Surprise, surprise! Not the best idea. Oh yeah, I have the new... whatever. Wait, who got banned? Uh, the Kuzi. Oh, let's see. gonna ram it into the ground but I was stopped. Oh but now I caused noise pollution for everyone. <laughs> for the squad. Yeah, don't worry. I use the 100% RP booster. And uh, that means we're going to get up to here into 12 -0, and uh, we're going to have only team killers on our team. No, 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 no. We'll also have M22s. Oh, yeah. And then there's going to be that one guy in a Tetrarch that spawns a Lancaster that he drops in our own spawn by accident. Yeah, dude. Misclick. <laughs> yeah, whoopsie. Dude, maybe uh, they should stop spawn camping us then. If they Probably spawned in on their weapon. side, so well, that means they're going to spawn camp our spawn, so we got to kill our teammates before they can. True, true. It's always fun when someone bitches about spawn camping when we have all three objectives and the entire team is either dead or in spawn or in air. Like, yeah, let me just let you through so you can drive onto a cap and prolong this. Or, you know, I could just kill you before you do any of that, and you can leave. I got the best quality fidget spinner out of a Kinder Egg. We're good. 
Age spinner. <laughs> I don't think I've ever owned one before. Now I own one of the highest quality imaginable. Here I also have one. It's a totally fidget spinner. You you can even hear it spin. Definitely not your mouse wheel unbound. No, it's actually a uh, little lanyard with the. Uh, <laughs> I see. Yeah, with a little something on it. <laughs> Old like belly belly button like what is it lint stuck to it that you found under your desk. Oh, yeah. See, Shiz is doing gaming moves because his stream just flickered. It's activated it's because the uh, I'm here. He knows I'm going to purposely throw, so he's getting them ready. See, you got the greatest deal of all time. I'm sad. I still haven't gotten, and I've still never gotten a single one of those deals. Yeah, well, one was the last time you ever bought something in game. Uh, today. Yeah, exactly. That's why. Oh yeah, they know I'm locked in already. <laughs> so they don't need to tempt me with the deal of all deals. Yeah, I haven't bought a premium in a while. I think I've bought any. I bought the TAF full price to speed to do the Italian Hungarian line grind. I didn't feel like doing it at 11 free with the ASA. That's the last thing I've bought full price. Before that, I bought like the. <laughs> Yeah, I just bought some stuff to grind with, like the uh, the Russian stuff and the ML. Oh, yeah. I don't have the ML, so I don't really have a reason for it. Yeah, I'm currently at a MiG-19, MiG and uh, that's as far as I am. I've been same thing with the uh, German too, the MiG-21 and their uh, 2A4. That way when I spawn in the MiG-21 I can just eat a uh, A-0 to the face. But just run, run rocket pods. Definitely work every time and not like... Oh no, it actually has flares though, so it's not too bad. Oh yeah, the... What, Lazur. Yeah. Yeah, so like the actually usable one. No, the MF isn't too bad either. It's just that it, the flare pod looks so stupid. <laughs> it looks like a turbo targeting pod, and it's actually just a flare dispenser that they Gaijin decided that we're putting here now. So, uh, Spidey, you want to ditch these people and play farming sim? Peak entertainment. Oh, yeah, the lady TM went a dinner in another place so I am free to order fat food if I want. Haha. <laughs> Don't you mean fast food, not fat food, okay? <laughs> food doesn't make you fat, okay? Oh, true, true. Uh, concentrated energy. That's That's a good way of putting it, right?
there's a term in Finnish that especially was used as a meme in the army, which is uh, elintasovatsa, which means uh, uh, standard of living belly. So especially when we have some reservist exercises and unsurprisingly when everybody is not in the exact same shape as they were in their 20s like early 20s or late teens for whatever reason people have you know grown older and it's elementasovatsa and that's what everybody's supposed to have and then it's a failure whenever you don't have one like the two things you're supposed to have in those exercises is a reservist Taliban beard and then a standard of living belly. Okay. So far, I've been failing on both. But one day, one day. That's why I need the fat food as well. <laughs> You've been studying at your game library for a while now. Yeah, that's, uh, that's pretty much how it is. You either have your staple standard game, or you just look at your nine hundred million games. Like <laughs> you got nothing, it's nothing to play. To play. <laughs> oh yeah, the new Warhammer DLC is going to be revealed like next week. The one with DLC for the Empire, Dwarves, and Nurgle. Imagine caring about forty k. Uh, excuse me, that's Fantasy Battles, your band. And I bought a full Votan, like 2,000 points of Votan, just because when I was like 13, I said that if they ever bring back squads, I'd buy an army of them. Which, like, two people heard, and why the fuck would they even remember it, like, 15 years later? But then when they released <laughs> Announced votes and I went shit. And well, I didn't have a choice. Two thousand points of squats. So you bought like one vehicle and one <laughs> company of infantry. That's crazy. Yeah, no, I, I bought two of the limited starter boxes and then a few of the heavy weapon squads and then a couple car extra characters. So it's like closer to three thousand. Oh, okay. <laughs> put everything, but, but is dude, I, I, I don't, I don't number well because I haven't played at all tabletop in years. Play like, guardsman, play... Neiman okay. Russ, <laughs> win. What do you mean I don't play Tau with a bunch of drones everywhere? And I've marked you with 17 target markers, and so you are now going to be hit by orbital lasers 17 times in four turns. Fucking marker lights, dude. Okay. Eight. There's an on us there as well. Have punches. Fuck! You're welcome for the hit for Machune. Yeah. Completely fucked you too, dude. So I am leaving you, shit. We're uh, going to have bail, bail us. One more. The fucking Jackson. He's like okay. driving towards Cap. I'm not looking at him, so he can't hurt me. Yeah, that's me. Yeah, yeah I was just trying to help. <laughs> <I know. laughs> just like half the drive. Uh, remember the Jackson is somewhere over there. I, I held W and have no idea where he is, but she's marked it, like, here. Uh oh. It's, like, right on top. He was driving towards the cab, towards, uh, the middle wall. The doggo wants to play. It's lying at the end of the hallway, staring at me. <laughs> Attention! That is not yeah. an AMX-13. Oh, fuck. Oh, an M36. Ha, ah, fuck you. Fucking squid. Yeah, I was getting shot by like seven different people. Meet them from across the map. That is back there. No, there's one of them. Yeah, Whoa. I see that, oh, but there's one. Okay. So you weren't lying after all. What the fuck is this? 
the shoot? Yeah, it's like yeah, an EVR yeah. or something. I'm trying to escape this artillery because that's that's gonna be really really bad here in a second. Is there off my right close? Ow! The guy on the right shot my gunner, so. And that's my transmission. He is being a hey, bitch. Should hit me. DC 40. Should he spawn the hell from here? Okay, he hit easy. me. Well, I got his commander gunner horizontal drive and turned the other two crew members orange. Uh, I'm gonna I'm be honest, gonna... for some reason I don't really want to go side on and go help you. You guys are fighters, I'll bring it to you too. Yeah, I'm turbo dead. I knew I was gonna die. I just... I was gonna go kill the EBR, I didn't realize our teammate had a line of sight. No, oh, it's a duster, okay. Dude, there's just some dude sitting here. Oh, crap. that an accurate mark? Yeah, it's a 34, he's gonna kill me. Alright, well, I'm gonna be Is perfectly late, so when you're dead, uh, he dies. Is that the pass I think? Yeah, I like don't have hands. I didn't even hit him once. <laughs> okay. Oh, man, you might die now because of accuracy. Yeah, it's fine, no, 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 whatever. No, 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 no. Dude, it had a thousand. Press T. Yeah, but it, was the shitty, it was the shitty t 1000. You wouldn't have. Press T, DP. Oh, he I hates me. Pictures. Yes, you can. He doesn't say it, but you can. It's fine. DP oh. hates me. So he just wants me to suffer. Uh, there's an AA uh, seaside spawn. There. Yeah. Uh, it's a TP. Oh, that's not good. This so is not a good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm on it. Okay, well, I'm. L I. He hit me once and I lost all control surfaces. So. Okay. Yeah. I still think it's stupid that you can get kicked from drilling swarm meets. People were abusing it. So now you have to abuse it by pressing buttons. <laughs> it sucks. <laughs> But yeah, I, I dropped it because you said he was going to kill you, so... Yeah, that dude's an outro bot. <laughs> so, uh... <laughs> yeah. A player in a 3485 being bad? What the fuck are you talking about? I'm going to hit on a 47. Aaron on this, uh, F82. He doesn't have the funny part. I... How bad is he? Dude, the yes. Another one going towards you, Zim. It's off your back left, but a kilometer. I see him, yeah, yeah. I won't be able to intercept him, but I'll be able to help you with it. Did you get the F-82? No. Oh, that's not good. He's like fighting on his way. He's uh no. He's having a moment. I'm not going to go head on. I just got slammed by a. Star down at two, both in the hole. Guns are like orange. Is that SD? Just, yeah. No, it's the Chinese one. Yeah, the ZSD. That SD. Oh, it's the ZSD? Okay. Yeah, that's the Chinese one. Oh yeah, the ZD is just... the... Yeah. Drill pads? Yeah! Got 13 rounds left. Yeah, I have I wasted like 500 on that? One iron coming. It's on UAC. That's not good. That's Stumping. really not good. It's a Corsair. I have three rounds. I am ditching my bombs because I am not a total bomb, just half a bomb. 
Yep. Dude, can you keep going up, please? Are you racist? Oh, I uh, killed his engine, by the way. What the? Oh, I'm, I don't have a rudder. I was wondering why the fuck the plane is handling like it's a drunk sack of shit, but that explains it. So yeah, apparently having a rudder isn't optional for flying in a efficient line. can't go get any fat food. I need to order in. That limits my options. No! Just walk oh, down the street. The you can have a Donald, Starbucks, a, uh, a Walmart too. Next, right, next thing. No, oh, I have a Italian place. Uh, that's a valley. Smoke is not quite straight. He's uh, missing a wing tip, or a wing, I should say. RKO. Uh, nearest. <laughs> that one video is <laughs> still pretty. <laughs> nearest McDonald's would be like. Mission accomplished. Six kilometers away, I think. So like three and a half miles. So that's like one mile then, guy. <laughs> I even translate it for you. I know, that's like four, maybe? Three and a half. No, because three, three is uh, four point, three miles is 4.8 kilometers, then Three and a half would be five and a half. That's three point seven. A one kilometer. Ooh. It's one point six. It's yeah. One. Yeah, I remember. Back in PE, running the point six five. <laughs> Instead of you know one k. Hell no. No, it was a point six five. <laughs> Into your vehicle. Yeah, we had a thing called Cooper, Cooper's Test, which is run for 12 minutes in a circle for as far as many times as possible. Which was essentially the run until you puke if you want to get good results. So the only thing we really had like that was the Pacer Test. It's a run on this side and that side. But then Back it's a bunch of suicides, pretty much. Yeah. Yeah, I'll just go the beat test here. Yeah, same. It's for us, it's the beat testing. The beat test. Because our beep is spelled P I I P. Okay. Good. Not even a beep anymore. Artillery barrage on its way. I'm not gonna eat shit. Artillery barrage on your sector. River! Ricochet off of the back one. 
And there's a guy pushing. There's someone right here. Uh. I'm about to die to artillery. One going out of edge. Yeah, I don't have a track, and this artillery is about there. to remove my TP, TP, TP. That Hellcat, no terror. Like, completely blown everything. Yeah. There's a ZD. <laughs> Push the 4 zoom. Back up, back up. Yeah, there's a paladin I'm... just sitting there watching that corner. I am going to go throw a 1,000 kilo oh, bomb yeah. on that sure. CD. Hmm. Oh, was it just a Centurion out there? No, T-34. Shit. T-34 out of See, the ZD is smelling what's happening. <laughs> He's becoming a smoke zit. Don't worry, a thousand in the middle of that letter A is gonna hit you no matter the there's smoke. There's also something back here. Yeah, there's like two there. Nice fuses. There wasn't a fuse. Oh. Those bombs just came down really, really slow then? Yeah, I've like, lost it. What? What? Oh, he's like engine forwards in a hole. Oh, uh, yes, a hole. Jeez. See that yeah. crater next to the IS? Yeah. The hole of the castle. Yeah, so he's fine. A boss of our spawn. I can't get an angle. Is it fresh? It looked like it moved. Don't know if it moved enough. Nope, it's out of spawn, bro. It's stuck there. I got its drivetrain. I just couldn't pull hard enough. He's dead. Gosh, and it's that guy. <laughs> I mean, I told him he spawned in. Oh, that messes. Duty. Ow! Got another boss bar. Some spawn problems. You know what I get? That's what I expect. Okay. You know, I was about to slam him in the face. Can I like bar some of you guys' engine power for a second? I need yeah, to climb back up. Well. Now he's probably typing something. There he goes. Because <laughs> <laughs> you know, someone who's actually from China says. <laughs> Dude, don't worry about it. He understands. Dude, these uh, Chinese people are speaking perfect English for the most part. Wow, dude. There's uh, one this air, one and then yeah, fresh, and then there's another air closer. Which spawn is he in? He, he actually respawned. He's right here in the Centurion. Uh, if you want to piss him off, tell him. Call him to tell him. Yeah, there's Centurion. the wyvern. But then, uh... Oh, there's a plane high plan. Oh, yeah. yeah. Uh, I'm gonna crash. Oh, that wasn't him. That wasn't him. He got in the wyvern. <laughs> what? How? How did he get a wyvern being two and four? I guess he got two wyverns. It was I can't believe I wasted my candy. I mean, I have a bomb. 
air of the AO going up to you, TP. He's off your back it's right. It's a P8, yeah. No, 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 there's a fighter on you, like, off the oh. back right. You guys lines. can, you know, kill me. Oh no, that that is yeah. that is a PE. Oh. Oh. Yeah, the P8 came in basically behind me and instantly got my engines. Wait, where are you? Oh yeah. Yeah, thank you. T T T T T T T T T. There you go. Yeah. T for TP. <laughs> I lost this PE8. He must just be in the cloud. Just press T for total eight. <laughs> it's, it's always best when people like that are baby raging and then they go, I don't talk to XYZ when the dude is literally the one who started bitching in chat. <laughs> like, oh, do you? Okay. Okay, what kind of fat food do I want? I can get pizza or Subway or, excuse me, Subway's healthy food. <laughs> yeah, it, it's only like 5% yeah, AIDS. <laughs> yeah, my, my bread with salt meat. Okay. <laughs> There's a vegetable in there. <laughs> yep, that makes it healthy. Actually, I might just wait for the lady TM to come home and then drive with the car so I don't have to pay for delivery. Or, you know, garbage. When she's on her way home, just make her pick up food. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, go. Okay, I, I know. Since you're already been, driving, I, yeah. Yeah, like, I know I have been home for, for the large majority of the year with aneurysms that are making me not allowed to go to work uh, and exploding here. But, you know, since you are in a car, how about you go pick it up? Wow, he's trying to cut me off. Sure. That gunner is alt tab. Or that commander is alt tab. Here, now you won't be able to shoot me. Dude, I'm helping. How to aim, but slightly undershot. And there's a lot of them there. That's a T28. Uh -huh. Shooting the Capola, then. Yeah. There's also a guy behind the century that I marked on that mark. Just gonna double you, each my die. Understandable okay. solution. Broke the track. Who is this guy? Okay. It bounced. There's a BT 5 or 7 or some shit. Oh yeah, this is the small one, so I was looking at the wrong spot for a Yeah, I forgot I have a rain fighter, I can, uh... Guns out the on the T-28. The, the BT-7, that cap that I killed, he's, you know, right, gonna fucking do 
something stupid to us. We might not have enough strong points for the Terminates. You know... BT-5 or... B BT-7M. Uh... Oh, okay. You make me sad. Wasn't it also determined that their tuna sub wasn't actually, like, fish? I don't know about that, but I can definitely say that in Finland, if they did they, that, they'd be like, <laughs> they they would be not here. Yeah. Anymore. <laughs> Rain finding for the wood. Oh, did you just snipe his capola? Yeah. Okay, that's not good. Uh, we are aborting that mission. That's a super Pershing. Surely I pin him. Never mind. Shot the shit spot. I'm stupid. Yeah, I gave up on that. Yeah, I shot like the worst spot imaginable and assumed that it would pin. Surprisingly, it did not pin. I... Now, what? It's cloud. Wait. Who the fuck can see? Oh, that guy can see me. That's not good. Artillery, artillery will save me. Oh my god, my elevator is... Okay, I just see... <laughs> I, my elevator was like slightly orange. I, I saw a zoom diving and I was like, maybe, maybe there's a chance I survive. And then I can see the angle it's going, like, okay. Guess well, no, not. that would've been fine. There's something damn. There's a lot of... A lot, yeah, it was like slightly scratched. Someone, the, the paint was yeah. chipped. Half of my other. I mean, orange. If people didn't want us to hit things with the paint, then why do they meant spray paint? Exactly. Give the good old uh, five gallon treatment that looks perfect from afar. Oh, this dude is still like very mad at me for whatever reason. And now I'm on perma fire without extinction. Get over your shoes? Absolutely oh, not. <laughs> well, I got uh, that, dude. There's an ISU one thing. It's like right here driving towards me. Oh, low cloud cover. That's not good for my survival. Ability. I will promise I'll try to kill him. I will not right. promise any results. I'll go hold W key and then die because I get marked on the map. Oh, I cloud cover at zero second fuses for me is usually one way trip with a 50 50 chance of killing something. My brain is. Oh, this dude is straight YOLOing me. It is, it is time to leave. I have overstayed my welcome. Where is he? He's behind. I think. Can't see anything in this fucking clouds. Oh, I see. Please tell me you're good. Good, yeah. Yeah, no. believe it or not, there's some tanks leaving their spawn. Yeah, I can't fucking see anything. So it's like bad. It just gets W key me. There's an SDA watching. Oh. And now we leave. Now we would say uh, a phrase called lapsus de Vaihtoon, which means slap and trade. <laughs> what does that translate to in English? Slap and trade. Oh, okay. Lapsus de Vaihtoon. It's essentially like if you have a sport, team sport where there's a bench. Oh, uh, yeah. So you slap hands when the guy comes into the bench and the guy yep. is like here. Is it tag in? Yeah, it's, it's a funny way of saying tag in. I thought that was like your guys' way of saying like adios amigos. No, that would be honest. Yeah, I was so confused by that. <laughs> Me 
and the P-47 were still friends. Me and this weather, we're not friends. That's so realistic. Dude, he's the strongest mouse around. Professional pilot. And I just, yeah, I couldn't hit him because he was a console guy throwing his uh, cyclic around. Oh, for some reason the ISU guy left the game. <laughs> I, I don't know what could have caused such a reaction. Being spawned, killed by a Leo AA, and then bombed when he's about to get it. Oh, he wasn't gonna hit me. I was gone. Oh, yeah. One of you guys like, marked their out of spawn, like seaside spawn. It's like there somewhere. Yeah. That's, that's an accurate mark. Oh no, the dude moved. <laughs> oh no, there's a jet incoming. Uh, that's all you, chap. Yeah, he's right there. Oh. Whoops. Oh yeah, now I see. We love rendering here. Yeah, I'm gonna do that and hope for the best. He's stuck there. On fire. Uh, jet's turning towards you. He's very mad at you. You turn fight me, let's go. Come on, you fat P47 piece of shit. Can I like borrow this? all your 50 cal ammo? Take your 50 cal as well. Yeah, can I like get your Mark 108's damage? He's crit, but. Yeah, Mark 108 out of the 50 cal, let's go. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sure we could figure that out. Just, you know, not alive anymore. There we go. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna go RTP. There's angry AA. That's all you. 50 cals, I think, for the most part. Is it like an M16 or something? No, just angry heavy tanks with 50 cals on top. Oh, uh, okay, yeah, that's all you then. Yeah, yo, so what I have like... Some legend fighter looks like a bear cat. Okay, so you need to shut your mouth and not tell me, because that manifests them into existence. I mean, if he goes on the cloud, you can't see, and things yeah, you yeah, can't yeah. see aren't real, okay? Yeah, exactly. So if she doesn't say it's there, it's not there. Checkmate. It's this heavy here. Should be good. Blew up all my elevators. But yeah, I still don't see the bear cat, so I guess it is over there. Oh, now I see it. It's a 47. God, I'm so bad with this gun. Tell me again why I didn't do this thing earlier when I was being super annoyed at the 2005 and getting bored <laughs> of the 109. <laughs> this is a 47 and it's super generic and you don't think... When you think fighter, you don't think 47. Dude, if he would have just gone on Reddit, he would have found that the 47 is the best cast plane in the whole game. Yeah, it's super good. Uh, so I'm going to end the stream, but I'll be back in like... 30 or 40 minutes if you guys are still playing it to check something right. sounds good so thank you everyone for watching and i will be on tomorrow and i have to right. go take care of this so uh later everyone